That never happens. You got a pen pen apple pen. What is that? I don't really know. That's the same thing. That's like a sheath. It's a shiny stick. It's girl juice <laughs> and a dress. Gamer, it's gamer girl pee. <laughs> I think that's a made outfit. Yeah. That's a uh, edible glitter. It's a camera for a Game Boy. Oh, you got lucky. Yeah, you did. <laughs> Your repeat rate is really high. You might have to throw in more coins than one at a time. Maybe, yeah. The more coins you put in, the uh, it's like more of a loss or whatever, something like something like That's that. Right. I forgot. The marginal Oops. utility of the coins does not exceed the marginal utility of the repeat rate until you're in like the high 90s. Holy shit! Yeah. That's really sad. Why do we get- who even likes the ski stuff? I don't know. Might it be Pekko, maybe? What? Why would Pekko Pe like that? I don't know, she seems athletic. She's got long legs. That water bottle was worth one coin and I got it. In here. <laughs> My god. You got a rock or a turd, I'm not sure. It's a slinky thingy. Are you guys having fun? I'm enjoying oh, this. That's definitely a turd. <laughs> oh, we're live now. Yep. That was uh, 20 years ago, Kelp. I still have like pop out the chat so I can keep it on the chat because Jack doesn't do his job. He never what? does. I'm right, literally... Like, watch the chat, Jack, and you just don't. I do. I do, especially during the art streams. I'm good what at getting that? chat during the art streams. Is it like rock salt? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe sea salt. Please give me something new. I wasn't new. Is that, like that, has? Is that a washing machine? Yeah, because you're so stinky. You're stinky. The fuck was that? It's a magazine for Kazuichi. I think Make that's sure he washes his hands after he reads it. What's up? Make sure he washes his hands after he reads it. Yeah. That's the thing for Buki, I think. The boy band thing. Oh, sweet. We should go give it to her. Yeah, Jack, why didn't you give Ibuki a present? We did. We gave her one present. I'm gonna give her a present right now, huh? Yeah, okay, I'll go to her graveside. Oh, wait. <laughs> yeah? Oh my god. What's up? We don't even know where she's buried. That's a big yikes. Yeah, what do they do with the bodies? Monokuma um, takes care of them. Monokuma removes them to be placed in a place that we don't know. The process into how many, teenagers. How many things, how many little oh. horse things are we gonna get? Hey Jack, what is that? No, oh, it was a man's nut. Well, we'll oh, do the rest man. later. Man's nut. I was giving a chance for Jack to recall what happened last time. What, by like, stimulating me with various different kinds of gifts? So I would yes. forget what we were doing? Yeah. So, Jack, what happened last time? I don't even know. A famous anti-energy drink that will make you feel very relaxed after drinking it became a huge hit through its marketing slogan, Blue Ram Clips Your Wings. That's kind of funny. That's just lean. <laughs> a dish made from boiled pearl barley. It is very nutritious and high in fiber. It also tastes good with beef tongue. Have you ever guys have you guys ever had that? No. The risotto no. or the beef tongue? That. The beef tongue, I think. I've had tongue. I've had beef tongue. It's delicious. What does it taste like? It's soft. They like cut it up into cubes and cook it usually. Weird. 
Hmm? I wasn't really enthused about it more than just give me the regular parts of their body. It feels good in tacos. That's such a weird way to, to put that. <laughs> chocolate chip jerky. Dry beef sprinkled with chocolate chips. A preserved meat product invented by an experimental cook. There's no guarantee this will actually taste good. What's up, Gil? Yeah. Like, excuse me? <laughs> that does oh. sound disgusting. You know how, like, dark chocolate tastes pretty good with a little hit of sea salt? No. The, the sure. slightest of hits. Like, they no. sell that sea salt dark chocolate. Yeah. Fine. Yeah. But if you are if if you do this with, like, a big honk of salt, which is what jerky is, and you're like, oh, yeah, I want the crack of chocolate with the chew of jerky, ew. I guess now we know what you're going to experiment with now, Jack. Got yeah, some jerky chocolate. Jerky chocolate. Jesus. <laughs> Google Hoof Cake. I'm not going to do that, by the way, Caleb. This cake is said to be a favorite of Marie Antoinette. The name is German for priest cap. If we get someone to describe this stream, you should. <laughs> see Google Hoof. Heart attack of hope. Please never say that. <laughs> <laughs> Viva Ice, the strawberry flavored shaved ice treat comes with a spoon containing lottery numbers. If your numbers win, you receive more shaved ice. I have what never liked... lottery number that wins more shaved ice even more? What's weird is like, I love ice, but I don't like snow cones. I love snow cones. Honestly, I should get a snow cone maker. Oh my What's the God. difference between a snow cone and shaved ice? It's the same, same thing. thing. I'm, I just said snow cone because it's easier. That's why she said easier. snow cones because, yeah, yeah. you know, normal people say snow cones. Oh, I thought the you differences... said that you don't like shaved ice, you like snow no, cones. No, I, I literally, no. <laughs> I don't, <laughs> I like, no. I like, like, ice. I, I just like ice in general, you know, you're not supposed to bite it, but I like biting the, the little tiny pieces. Yeah, you just like Larka. Oh my god. You don't like 10 pounds of sugar and syrup when you do that? You know, not a fan. Mm -hmm. Just gotta say that right now. A natural salt found on Jabberwock Island, though it's commonly used to cook various island dishes, apparently it's also used for strange ceremonial rituals by the local natives. You what were, local natives? You were right, Sasha. It is like rock salt, basically. Yeah. Why is that sea salt, though? Or whatever, you know what I mean. Kokoshimi. The pulpy white insides of a coconut. If you eat it with soy sauce and wasabi, it tastes like sashimi. Really? No. No way. Brightly colored jeans, afraid jean pants of a detective who roared at the sun in the name of justice. They're not jeans, they're jean pants. They look like cloud pajama uh, pants. Like, tell me. Parachute pants? Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean. Like, it looks like cloud yeah. print on a pajama. Oh. It's... No, that's just a nut. Queen's oh straight jacket. This hand binding garment was worn by the genius magician Queen Taruko during her escape magic performances. Apparently, there are people who might enjoy being bound up. So oh, Hot Bitch says the local game. natives equals monomy. <laughs> <laughs> spy true. spike. A spike that you can wield with swiftness and agility, just like a real spy, also known as spy spy. Okay. Wait, is that a shoe with a fucking spike in it? Yeah, um, oh. I assume, yeah, like... James Bond. Yeah, James Bond, thank you. Uh, from Russia with love. Secret boots. Boots have raised a lot of the wear to fake their height. I already saw that. Nice. Yeah, why does it say it's new? Because we... remember, we did a bunch of like re reloads to try and make Oh, it new. that's right. Safety half shoes. These shoes only cover your toes, but the iron plate in the tip keeps your toes safe. Hold on. What? That looks like fucking heels. <laughs> it looks like flats. What the hell? I don't oh, know. Oh, you know what? It's because they're black, and then you just don't realize those aren't actually like model oh. legs. This is actually just part of the shoe. Have you read this one, Jack? Yeah. Silver ring. A ring made from the purest silver with a natural pink tourmaline set into it. If you need to get a present for someone and have no ideas, get them this. Amazing. Tourmaline is oh. special for some kind of physical property. I forget what it is, though. It's something oh, really neat. Shoes with the heels are the fucking best. <laughs> shoes with heels are tight. So she prefers <laughs> five-inch heels. For, I really forget what it was about tourmaline. Like... Is it? Oh, nope. I know what it is. Tourmaline's that. It's the, so you know how people are like Himalayan salt lamps? Because this is a Veritasium video from a while ago. Um, Himalayan salt lamps. If you heat them up, then they release negative ions, and that's better for you, and it's just complete bullshit. Thank you, Jack. Okay. Well, I mean, it is. Because they don't release negative ions. But Tourmaline will. 
Termaline will actually lose some, uh, you know, into the into the air, and you'll be like, "Oh, look at that ionized atom! Wow!" Uh, uh. And that's when you get superpowers, right? <laughs> yeah, that's when it has essentially no effect on your health whatsoever. Nothing noticeable at all. Spectre Ring. A blonde Earthling was wearing this ring when he was swept into our world from a distant galaxy. A very icy, lame joke is sealed within the ring. Okay. Wow. What the hell is that, that a like reference a Sonya to? like gift. Jabayan Jewelry. A pendant designed with a coconut tree motif. There's a custom on Jabberwock Island in which parents give this to their children so they can one day pass it down to their own kids. What a great custom. <laughs> Here's a thing. Give it to your kid. Why? Because it's what we've always done. <laughs> because I don't want it anymore, and you do, and I don't. Ubiquitous handbook. A perfectly designed handbook used for documenting various events that occur throughout the day. It comes with a pen that can easily be stored inside. There are so many. Measuring flask laboratory. Feminine. Da -da -da. It's the opposite of the male's cylinder. Okay. Flash suppressor. Manufactured um, by Volcanic okay. Knuckle. Go ahead. Uh, Hoppage says, they release negative ions, crying emojis. Likewise, the carbonation on a can of soda releases beta radiation all the time. These particles are so small, it's nothing to us. The carbonation does that? Really? I... I don't think that's true. Does that mean you guys will all become ghouls? Because you guys carbonation? drink soda? Carbonation is literally just escaping uh, carbon dioxide. And you're saying that it's releasing free electrons with well, sufficient energy? It, it depends on if the carbon dioxide itself is releasing any sort of radiation, I guess. I... I've heard, that, like, right. coal, I've heard that like coal plants and coal dust can actually accrue, can actually emit quite a bit of radiation. Not like as much as like a chunk of uranium, but still measurable. Right, because of radium uh, contaminants, right? I, I think just any. I think it's just in general. I don't think it's just for radium. Anyways, that's beside the hmm. point. Manufactured by Volcanic Knuckle, attaching this item to the barrel of a gun will suppress the muzzle flare and recoil while firing. However, this item will also amplify the sound of the shot to sound like a tiger's roar. Oh. What? <laughs> I don't know. Lilienthal's wings. That's actually what? entirely true. Um, when you redirect the um, gases out the end of your gun, or you don't, it, it, it will actually wind up being louder because you're redirecting in a direction that you're not expecting, basically. So instead of having all of your sound go out one way, or all of your sound kind of spreading out in like a cone in front of you, you've now directed it to all go out a bunch of ports in your barrel, which is so it's, it amplifies it through those ports, basically, which is why it's more loud. Popitch screams, any carbon. <laughs> any... Any carbon? I mean, like, there are common isotopes of carbon, but... Is that... Wouldn't a, a different isotope of carbon be relieving al rele releasing alpha radiation, not beta? I don't know. Lilienthal's wings, a model left behind by flight engineer Otto Lilienthal. It's filled with the dreams of those who aim for the sky. Not interested. It's filled with dreams, not hopes. <laughs> Izzy, we can't hear you. I'm sorry. It hit the. I think I hit the mute button while moving the mic closer. Rip. It's. Uh, I said I don't know what that's a reference to. Uh, it must be, right? Uh, usually most of these things are references. The Fun Plane. The newest popular portable game system it has a high-def touchscreen. It can also play music and videos, making for the perfect all-in-one media machine. American Clacker. A toy consisting of two balls tied with string. You play with it by swinging the balls together to produce a clack-clack sound. Adults and children alike are fascinated by this toy. Power Gauntlet, a video game controller shaped like a glove. You use your fingers to play games, but it is not compatible with modern game consoles. Diehard fans love how bad this thing is. Really? <laughs> is this the... Power glove reference? Yeah, the Nintendo Power thing? Oh my god. I love the Power Glove. Yeah, we what so is the Nintendo bad. Power Glove? Uh, it was, a, was it NES or SNES? I think it was SNES. This yeah. Is Nintendo yeah. peripheral where, like... Instead of pressing the buttons, you would move your fingers, and it would, like, assume that you meant pressing the button based on the way that you moved it. Okay. And it, it, catch on. it doesn't work. Yeah. It just, it's a piece of crap. It doesn't work. It, uh -oh. it was like, you know, I guess it wasn't E3, but, like, you know, way back in the day or something. Like, it was at some kind of convention thing, and it was really hyped up. Oh, they made, like, a movie where they tried to hype it, too. I think it was called The Wizard. 
Oh, I remember. It's super yeah. old, though, right? Like, they could do that today and have no problem, because now they're trying to do things where it interfaces with your brain. Yeah. No, well, it probably worked like, much better now. Well, the technology yeah, that, that just wasn't PBR. there back then. It, it didn't take off, so then they're like, well, we're never going back to it. <laughs> That's literally what they did with the Wii U, so yeah, they're embarrassed. <laughs> yeah. VR is gonna VR is gonna move in that direction probably the next number of years here, using power glove and shit. This is hmm. the best technology of all, right, Jack? An old timey radio, a radio with a retro <laughs> exterior, but save the art technology inside. All you got to do now is create a radio station. It's just that easy. <laughs> oh. Moon uh, rock. We read the moon rock. Yeah, I'm just gonna have we seen this one no another battle the first in the series of yakuza films it became popular for being a yakuza film that had no battle scenes in it whatsoever <laughs> uh hoppage says i never knew the wii u was its own console i thought it was like a wii unlocked or something to like to download more content yeah that was the biggest failing is that it sounded too similar to the wii so nobody bought it because they thought it was just a like an upgrade for it or something oh yeah you have like, like a second bike screen thing too that like didn't come off because it basically meant you had a tablet like stapled to your console well it, it was like the switch but worse and that's essential because they wanted to make the switch but people like you know executives were like actually make another console and they were like lol rip <laughs> <laughs> a high quality tool used for floral arrangements the needles are inserted into flowers and branches rain snowy red I was right that it was a sheath. Gold-coated sheath, a bamboo sword sheath with a beautiful gold finish on the part where the blade is inserted. I wonder what that's a reference to. <laughs> I think we Stardust. read this one. Small bottle of Stardust said that owning this item is enough to make you happy, despite its name is from the actual shell. It's made from the shell of a small sea creature. Huh. Yeah, I read that Bojibo one. Bojibo dolls, seven sword. A sword discovered inside a clay doll excavated from the island. The blade has the unique characteristic of branching off into seven blades, but its number of uses is already maxed out. Sand god, storm horn. A broken horn from some unknown creature. Those who possess this horn will be able to read the wind. This is a hardcore Gundam gift. But you can't say it five times fast. Ooh, the just made a very interesting comparison. Wait, what the fuck? The baseball player used a sword, and the sword's been used a bat. Am I high or something? This is wild as fuck. Holy uh, shit! You're oh, that's right. Kinda clever. That's awesome. That's a see. There's a supposedly there's a lot of tie-ins with the first one if you're looking for it, which makes me nervous. Where what's coming up next? <laughs> Bar, metal tool used to remove nails or apply leverage. Not to be confused with this J-shaped cousin, the crowbar. Dip pen, a pen used for drawing lines by absorbing ink into the nib. Depending on your technique, you can create vivid lines with it. The pen of choice for manga artists and illustrators. Why would they have something for for Toko if, in this one, though, is the thing. Nobody here would use it, right? Uh, I don't know. People write with things, usually, even if they're not writers. Hmm. Compact costume. By chanting a secret spell, this mysterious compact mirror will transform you into anything, even if you're a girl who doesn't stand out much. This item will help put you at the front and the center. What the hell? Okay. Angel's fruit. Despite its toxic appearance, this fruit bears a sweetness that will take you to heaven. However, they say that those who eat this fruit will be possessed by evil and fall to the dark side. Excuse me? What? Keep Anakin away from it. Okay, nobody eat the ball sack fruit. Got it. <laughs> bandage wrap, a cloth bandage wrap used to treat wounds. In some cases, you can also use this to demonstrate your morbidity or cruelty. Okay. Secret wind sword book. A book documenting a certain sword technique named after Sayaka M. The beautiful movements of this technique look like you're cutting through fluttering flower petals. Even the sword itself looks like it's singing. Who's, who's that, Jack? I don't know. Really? Yeah. Who's the person we know that has last name with M? As if Jack's gonna remember that. I don't. I mean, I remember Sayaka's name being Sayaka. I don't yeah, remember. Yeah, what's her last name? Monami. No. Why so no? Oh. Asasha well, should she know probably that. needs to get better <laughs> technique. Like that's oh awful. Oh my god, we already seen if that. She, if, she, if she had a better technique, maybe she would be alive. Uh, Sasha should know that because Aaron and Dan really ran off with that Italian accent. Oh yeah, that's just 
was endless. Dude, the, it was Forget too it. far. <laughs> Hoppage says, lol, I remember Sayaka being Sayaka, but I don't know the last name. The mystery remains unsolved. We were doing something here, and Sonya was like a big deal for I this. Like, no. Oh, we were you supposed were to do a plan! We were supposed yeah. to execute a plan to neutralize Nagito. Do you, do you remember anything else that happened last time? No. Where are you going? You gotta um, talk to Sonya before you go to the restaurant. Oh my god, this is where we're supposed to be. You just... What do you mean? Right? What do you go, mean? Try to go back to the restaurant. Or the to the lobby. Did I save? Maybe I should save. Huh? Don't save it right now. Oh my god, is it you just <laughs> loaded the... No, why are you talking? To, you have to talk to Sonya! <laughs> what? Is what? this Sonya who you're supposed to meet up with? Yeah. I don't remember. Well, imagine if you did. Let's see what's going on here. Oh my god. Hey, Fuyuhiko, what are you doing? Why are you this uh, worked up and you don't even remember who you're supposed to be talking to? <laughs> I know. <laughs> I know. Hot Pitch says, oh, thank god. Are we are finally taking out Nagito. Hey, that's gotta <laughs> mean. <laughs> <laughs> Fuyuhiko? Damn right. Oh, it, it's you. I was just looking at this photo here. It's the first time I've seen a photo of Pekko and me where we look like equals. Damn it! Yeah. <sighs> Mahiru. When the hell did she even take this photo? I... I mean, you do know that it wasn't taken any later than a particular time. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Ghost photograph. <laughs> Did I just see a flicker of light in Fihiko's single eye? Was he crying? Please stop! <laughs> I think I should leave him alone. Aww. Get out, we're having a meeting in here. Hobbit says, laughing my fucking ass off. Bruh, just hug him! <laughs> I did not know that was there, because, uh. Yeah. That's sad. It is like, sad. Look, this girl that I'm into, she's dead now, but I'll enter. <laughs> you ready, Jack? Yeah. Um. Hajime, you are late. We have to talk Get to Fuyu. You. Huh? I'm right on time. Wait, should I come a little earlier? A little earlier? In my country, you're severely punished. You didn't arrive 13 minutes before the range meeting time. Oh, fuck that. Yeah. For such an orderly country, 13 minutes is a pretty arbitrary rule. That is... We're not in your country, are we? No, oh, I see. This is a shock. <laughs> then I guess this could be overlooked. Damn fucking straight. So where are you planning to go? I just have to come along, right? Oh, that's right! She has some secret business with us! Yeah, bro. Oh my god, we're gonna go get that Mekango and we're gonna fuck. I mean, we're gonna get that Mekango. <laughs> I like how Jack started out with, like, really being into Akane, and now he's just all into Sonya. I never was that deeply into Akane. I mean, like, she is Hina-adjacent, that's true, but she's not Hina. I mean, it's service level, or specifically, you know, five-foot level. <laughs> Hina's, <laughs> Hina's not really all that smart, and yet she feels way smarter than Akane. I think because Hina's more involved. She's more empathetic. Hoppage says he wasn't yeah. that deep. He just dipped the tip with Akane. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why, Jack? Uh, I don't know. Next. Well, of course. It is a place that pertains to this discovery we made yesterday. Oh my God! That's right. We were looking around the fifth island. <laughs> Jabberwock Island development plan? Question mark. You find out something about it. How should I say this? After reading this document over and over again, I suddenly realized the Future Foundation was planning to rebuild a facility on this island to use as their headquarters. Oh, we knew that. You're talking about the large administrative building on the central island, right? But I couldn't find a building like that anywhere. Maybe they said something about a different island. Wait, no, wait you're wrong. Hmm? Or what if their plan suddenly changed and they had to use a different facility? Whoa, a different facility. Well. Was there not a facility on this island inscribed with the symbol the Future Foundation? Yeah. As I recall, the ancient ruin on the second island had such a symbol on its door. 
Yeah, you're right. The Japanese word for future Mirai was inscribed there. Oh, you're going to have to find the password for the door. Yeah, and we have to take that risk because if we get it wrong, we get shot. Yeah. If that's the case, that ruin might be connected to the Future Foundation, right? Wow, you're going to go with that. That's your conclusion you're going to take from that. The door that says Future Foundation on it might have something to do with the Future Foundation. I say nothing suspend wrong. Suspend your disbelief and, and go with it. They might be onto something. God, <laughs> the discrepancies in the document are strange. But there's no doubt that the ruin is quite suspicious. You're right. I'd completely forgotten about it after being locked inside the funhouse, but the possibility that the ancient ruin is connected to the Future Foundation is incredibly high. I knew there was something strange about that place. Sonia, after hearing all this, I want to go there as much as you do. I'll definitely come with you. And then I may not be competent, so please be patient with me. What? Hoppit says Hajime really is a normie. I see, I see. At the ancient ruins on the second island, the word Mirai, or future, was inscribed on the door. The discrepancies in the document are strange, but there is no doubt that that ruin is quite suspicious. Didn't I predict it, Izzy? What? I told you I was like, I, I said this earlier before I said, you know what, Sonya probably wants to go to the uh, ruin or whatever on the other island. Wow. I She's like literally that. the only one who cares about that. It's kind of weird. Like everybody else just kind of forgot about it. Oh no. <laughs> Do you really think someone as unimportant as you is allowed to walk with Miss Sonya alone? It is strange, no? Hmm? I allowed it. Damn it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, feel like gonna you. Murder. I feel like the next murder is going to be him attempting to murder us. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be so good. Then we get to stab him. Kazuichi won't listen to me no matter how much I tell him. I... <laughs> but I won't give up. As a teacher, I must correct my students for good. Ooh, I can think of voice. something to tell him that might help him understand. <laughs> what? And it Look is conveniently it. only one word, and I think Caleb knows what it is. <laughs> I am He's already walking away from the mic. Oh, oh shit! God. My stalker, I mean, Kazuichi is over there. <laughs> oh so Sonya totally knows what's going on. She's, like, oh, yeah. she's not oblivious, she's like, yeah, I'm stuck with this. <laughs> You want to finish the last part there, Caleb? I did. I said let us apart so he does not notice us. Oh, I thought you were saying it like you. No. She's treating him like a stalker, huh? I'm starting to feel even sorrier for that guy. I'm not. So what? Why him? Well, like, uh, since we did Sonya's, like, uh, special or free time event stuff, like, we know that she actually really hates being treated like a princess. She just wants to be treated like normal. So it's like even worse for her because mm -hmm. it's just putting extra pressure on her. Of course, she could just talk to Kazumichi a little bit. Well, she she did, but he doesn't get it. <laughs> I don't know, man. We talked to Kazuichi and it uh, wasn't great. <laughs> I think we've read all this. I think yeah, you know, we read all these people out here. Well, except for except for Kazuichi. Kazuichi had changed. new stuff because we walked out with Sonya. Chiaki, are you new? Wait, Chiaki's new. She wasn't here before. Okay. Hey, Oops. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what exactly does Kazuichi do as a commander? How should I know? Well, in games, commanders are usually flags. Flags. Um, if you if you defeat the commander, no matter how many of their units are left, you still secure a victory. Even damaging the commander is enough to decrease the opponent's morale. As far as plans go, it's a pretty standard tactic. I think we'll be okay in this case. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. That plan is my seal of approval. Continue to target the commander. What? Please get him out of here. <laughs> You're totally mistaking who to fight. What's the point of targeting Kazuichi? That is... You're right. 
What a shame. <laughs> shame? <laughs> because Weechi heard that, his rapidly diminishing enthusiasm might plummet into the negatives. I don't know why, but I'm starting to feel sorry for that guy. I mean, I kind of feel bad for him because you never want somebody to be in their life. But also, she doesn't want him. Get over it. Yeah. Well, he's got to take the hint eventually. He's just been doing it like over and over again. And it's, yeah. at this point, there's just like no excuse you can make for it anymore. I like Kazuichi when he's not being a sub. So if, like when he made the little robot or, uh, you know, he's hanging out with, uh, mm -hmm. who's he, he was hanging out with, uh, Nakamaru and Fuyu, like before when they first tied him up in Naito. Mm -hmm. I don't want to do it, but since I already accepted my role as decoy, I'll go through with it. You'll be fine. Uh, Unless you fall asleep on the job. Well, she ex I don't know if you remember, but she expressed, like, she doesn't think this is a good idea. She doesn't really want to do it. Right. Something horrible is going to actually befall Chiaki. Remember when poop. we knew what we were Check doing? Check the poop. <laughs> Check the poop. Oh my Check god. Poop. When are you going to go and do things? <laughs> When are you gonna die? Her final constipated form. Whoa. Hey, Sonia. I see. I see. At the ancient ruins on the second island, the word oh my gosh, features girl. described under the door. Describes is okay, we've seen this. Maybe she's just telling you in case you saved here and forgot, like Jack does. Wow. What's wrong, Jack? Zoom. Go zoom. Hold it right there. There's no time for such detours. <laughs> now then, let's proceed to the ancient ruin. All right, calm down. He said, hold it right there. Wow, you went the wrong way. Oh, God. All of them are open now. Isn't that crazy? No. Oh, okay. Oh, you're here again? Are you going to say <laughs> something new? No. no. Okay. Well, I'm glad you'd like to just continuously talk about the same thing. That's fine. Uh, again? Sonia, why No, are you, you know <laughs> she's not gonna... <laughs> Come on. <laughs> you gotta check, okay? You, had your you don't got to. You gotta. Poop. What if they're like gonna go through this whole plan and Nagito's already at the ancient ruin? Kill him. I wouldn't put it past him. <sighs> Uh, no matter how many times I see this place, it certainly gives me the willies. However... Well, we should not dwell on that. After all, we are here to look for clues. That's right. There's no doubt we'll find something here. Alright, let's start. Ooh, the investigation music starts. There's shit that you clean! <laughs> There's shit in this toilet! <laughs> um. Oh, but this okay. facility, now that I've taken a better look at it, it cannot be. It bears an uncanny resemblance to Hope Two Academy. Why is that? I feel like we established that already. Uh, we did, but the characters chapters didn't. ago. I don't think the characters really focused on it. What do you want to do, Jack? Look at everything that needs looking at. This LCD display next to the door. This is probably it. This is probably the key. This door will probably open if we input the correct numbers. Please wait. It discussed this before as well, but it would be dangerous to test haphazardly. Well, it's an Agito. If we make a mistake, it is possible that we were fired upon by that gun. That's actually a really good idea because Nagito is lucky. So just have him test a password. <laughs> yeah, and there's another thing that he is that makes him the perfect guy to test the password. Yeah, what? Expendable. Oh. <laughs> now you're understanding. Jesus. I can think of no other reason for that gun to be there. As long as there's a possibility, it'd be bad if we acted recklessly. 
concerned. That is right. Courage and recklessness are completely different. If you were shot at by a gun like that, you'd have more holes in you than a Beatrice's nest. A what? A Beatrice's nest, I don't know. You mean a bee's nest? Oh my god. You are wrong. Uh, in my country, we use the expression Beatrice's nest. I don't... Anyway, Beatrice right now, stupid. we definitely shouldn't test it out so recklessly. What's wrong, Jack? I kind of don't believe her. I'm starting to wonder if her country exists. <laughs> <laughs> How could she be an ultimate princess? I don't know. Maybe she just told everyone that. She just pretended? Yep. Okay. In order to open this door, we must find the password first. Or destroy the door with some kind of explosive force. I mean, you have a bunch of military hardware like on the other island. No, uh, that's impossible. This door looks extremely sturdy. You think like a helicopter or a tank or something? <laughs> Might have present uh. the missile launcher that you saw. <laughs> <laughs> that fires like, you know, building busters. <laughs> it's definitely better if we find out the password instead. Alright, all we have to do next is find out what that password is. It's a good thing we came here so we could at least find that out. But you don't know. You are right. Um, Hoppitch says, weren't there grenades in the octagon? That is true. Yes, However, sir. grenades probably wouldn't blow open a door like this. You need something pretty hefty. The like only person tank? left to go into the octagon is a person we don't trust. <laughs> well, even a, even a tank um, probably wouldn't be enough either. You need to have a pretty hefty explosive shell to pull open the door enough for you to do, to do things. Because at a certain point, you're just going to damage the door, and you need the hole to be big enough to get through. Because if you damage the door, you, it, it's not opening no matter what you do. So you actually have to blow a hole big enough to get through. Yeah, or use the tank to, like, pull the door open. Can you melt it? Uh, depending on the thickness, if it's like a, if I'm thinking it's like a uh, missile silo door, because I've seen those, I mean, if it's more of a foot or two thick, like, no, can't, not with a regular blowtorch. Hmm. Sonia, you educated, make thermite. <laughs> but the problem is, where would we obtain that password? When we first came here, even Monokuma and Monami said they didn't know the password. If they really don't know it, how are we supposed to find out? Hmm. As usual, it's a mystery, huh? After oh, finishing our investigation... Just... Sorry, go ahead. No, you go ahead. Couldn't you just, like, destroy the gun and then just type in the password all you want? That would be the logical, ex logical choice. Hmm. Well, they might be afraid that if they tamper with the gun, it'll start going off. Maybe. After finishing our investigation of the ancient ruins, Sonia and I decided to go back to our cottages for now. Well, Obviously. like in the first game, like they have sensors, right? They they know when somebody's nearby. They're like the cameras are there. He's just gonna set it off. You know. Yeah, makes sense. Also, Hoppage says Sonia craft napalm. <laughs> <laughs> Sonia use fire blast. <laughs> It's to the middle of the day. It looks like I have some free time. Whoa. Alright. Whoa. What should I do? We should go to Chiaki. Chiaki is busy right now. Probably, yeah. No. No to what? Especially no to that sleeping. question. Yeah, we watched this just the last time. <laughs> oh my god, is, is, is he actually getting into it? I think he is. It's too late for him now. It's called Stockholm Syndrome. <laughs> Chiaki was dreaming about Monokuma. Um, Hajime is collecting Monokuma. They saw Monokuma being built. He paid a million and a half dollars for a movie ticket. <laughs> yeah. Uh... Well, it's for you. Jeez. A capture plan, huh? Will they really be able to capture Nagito with such a stupid plan? I, mean, he's I guess we'll never plan, respond so. to that question. 
<laughs> You'll never know. God, there's so many dead people. Thank you, Cal. Thought you'd appreciate. Um, excuse me? Are these the only people available, or...? I think so. Yeah, go outside. Well, Thank you! Well, yeah, I that's... Mean, Nagato's MIA... I just want to see what... Sonia's already... Can you... Done. H Hello? Okay. <laughs> I want to see what Kazuichi has to say. He's probably upset. I think you have... Uh, points with uh, Kazuichi. Yeah, we spent time with him a little bit. Yeah, in the funhouse. Oh, God. Because There's there no was choice. literally no one else. Rip. How does it feel being the lowest common denominator? <laughs> Oof. You know, right? How'd you make it? I speak to you real quick. There's something important I need to talk to you about. Wow, that's actually really tempting. Anyway. <laughs> where's, where's Sonia? Do we see her? On the map? I think we did. Wasn't she back at that place? She's still hanging out at like, Gun Town? Or... Uh, where oh, are you, did. Sonia? I know we've done her already, but I just want to know where the hell she went. Whoa. There she is. She's in Sea King. Oh, Wire. Nagito's in the military base. <laughs> Nagito's in the military base. Oh, I kind of want to know God. why. <laughs> you think we can find him? I want to find him, yeah. I mean, we're not going to talk to him because we screwed up the thing, but. You see Nagito putting on a helmet and starting up the tank. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Didn't he say, hey, uh, Monokuma, does, you don't need to provide a motivation? Yeah. Nope. <laughs> Where's the murder weapon? Oh, here it is. <laughs> it's a like, ten-ton tank. <laughs> what are you doing over here, you freak? Stop it. Yeah, I just guessed what all these buttons you have to press to make it turn on, and look, it worked. I'm happy you're asking someone like me, but I have other things I need to do. I, I completely forgot I was supposed to actually... I've been, like, <laughs> shit-talking in his lines all stream, and I forgot that I actually had to read his lines. <laughs> So don't worry about me. Have fun spending time with the others. Wow. Okay. He it's was not like, creepy at all. fuck off. But yeah. in like the nicest, like that's actually the nicest way he said to fuck off. Uh, compared to everyone else. Like Akane straight I'm concerned about it. Well, Akane, Akane, remember Akane was like, actually, I don't feel like talking to you. And you I'm were like, yeah, you were like, okay. And you still hung out with her. It's like, Ew. oh my God. Excuse um, me. Nagi remember when Nagito was like, you're inferior to everyone? <laughs> yeah. Oh that, you really that's don't what I trust mean. him. That's what I mean. Like, he's so rude. But for some reason, he was really nice to you by saying, hey, fuck off. <laughs> God, not, uh, Hoppage says Nagito is all right. I have nothing against him. It's just getting him before he gets us. Ha <laughs> becoming the mask. <laughs> I wonder where we might find the password to enter the ancient ruin. I'm doing a lot of talking this time. I'm not sure I like it. You are? I mean, yeah, I'm Sonya, and like we always talk to Nagito. Oh my God, you'll be fine. Yeah, so we opened up this chap this, this section of the chapter with we have to talk to Sonya, and so now you're like, it's too much talk. <laughs> too well, much work. Why don't you think about the time when Sasha had to talk to himself when we went in Strawberry Tower and Grape Tower. Hey, I had to do that too with Nagato and Monokuma. They did that for like 10 minutes. Uh, Izzy, I, I feel like you were did. a little redundant saying it's Strawberry Tower and Grape Tower. Why? Considering well, you know, we had to figure the out same the tower. tower. Whoa, they're the same tower? tower? I didn't know when that. When did they say that? I don't know. It's news to me. <laughs> no, I, I did. I, Sonia did tr troll me and was like, hey, stop it. Look at that. The worst fucking lighthouse ever. It's between two bridges. Are you okay, Jack? Oh, wow. I did want to inspect this thing. Oh, I, oh yeah. Um, okay. Excuse me? I didn't know we could actually it. go. And can I just see it? Oh, yeah. It's okay. back to normal. Never going in there again. Good one, Hajime. <laughs> <laughs> you know you are. What does that mean, Jack? Look at a, look at this boy's legs. Um, while you guys go find Chiaki, I think the puppies need to go potty. 
Okie doke. Blobberies. Leggy, 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 leggy. Blondy, 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 blondy. Uh, what? You know that song now. Do I? Yeah, Fly to the Concords, Leggy Blonde. Mm. Wow. If only I could find the hotel. All our problems would be I solved. I thought you were going to say, if only I could find who asked. <laughs> who asked? Yeah. <laughs> wow. I thought you were going to go with, if only I could find the hotel. Motel. <clears throat> Holiday Inn. God damn it. I really wish my life Some of the did little not song exist. reference for you, Izzy. Are you sure you want to talk to Chiaki? Like, look at all these wonderful people you could talk to. Okay, it's it's her or it's Fuyu. Didn't we max out with Fuyu? Not nope. yet. We're tied Please? with her and Fuyu, and it's really depressing because we need three with each of them, I think. Oh god. You can take a look. Nice. Who are we gonna dunk. pester all day? Report cards. Report. Wait, oh, we only need one with Fuyu? Yeah. We just spent time with Fuyu. Oh, yeah, no. All fucking... All that goddamn tower with Fuyuhiko. Mm. No! We have to do Fuyuhiko then. We have to it's get... It's too late. You always... It's too nope, late. Nope, we, we always go for... This is what I've always told you in XCOM. You go for the kills. You take oh them off the board. Oh my god. You're gonna get Fuyuhiko <laughs> off the board. Are you freaking kidding me? Well, I don't know how many free times we have left. If we have three, I would put them all to Chiaki, but we don't know. So we have to go with Fuyu. Are you joking, Jack? Sa save somewhere else then, if you want. I'm not joking, because uh, I don't. I, if we only have two left, then there's no point in wasting them on Chiaki. You're so cruel. I, I, my first pick was Chiaki, but we didn't get that in Chapter 4. Well, uh, okay, you have to make a choice. Which one? I think you saved the game, and we're going with Fuyu. Can't believe you've done this. Jeez. Jack, make a choice. Jack, why have you made a choice? <laughs> Sasha, you don't even know. <laughs> I mean, it's really sad because I was really hoping to see more of Chiaki and actually finish her, but... We can finish instead... her if you want. Well, we can't because we you don't have, have to, enough free time. You have times. to focus on her if you want to finish it. Do we have three free times with her? I don't uh, know. I didn't check. <laughs> This is a spoiler. Have, Let me see. If we actually could do three with her, then we'll do the three with her and leave Fuyuhiko on five of six. That's fine. But if we don't, then... We ain't doing it, bruh. Doing your butt. Doing your butt. Doing, doing your butt. Please don't say that. Uh... Yeah, can I see? Jack screwed us here, I think. I did no such thing. You 100% did. Wow. You haven't, haven't even made the choice yet. Yeah, but I think... Nope, that's not it. That ain't it either. Oh my god, Jack, you did. You screwed us over here. Wow. I don't know if we have three left. Uh, I can confirm that we do not have three left. Alright. Jack destroyed us. I feel I like it's not even... It's not even my fault. It is. That's so... That's so you shit. send it with a pookie instead. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, I didn't know at the beginning of the game. I knew. I knew you would Damn do it right. from the very what? beginning. Wow. <laughs> yeah, if I hadn't wasted one on Ibuki, then we would have been able to complete Chiaki just by the skin of her teeth. And not complete Fuyuhiko. We could have completed Fuyu. I returned. No, Wait, not, not the way we spent. With, you're not hanging out with uh, Chiaki? What happened? We need three, <laughs> and we don't have three. And Fuyuhiko's five of six, so we're doing Fuyuhiko instead. Ah, Jack. I know, it's really sad. Um, I don't know why you're blaming me, though. It's I'm blaming you, Jack. Jack. Yeah, you're the one who chooses to very spend free time. Yeah, expecting that there's not going to be some kind of block on being able to hang out with them later. Perhaps you should be thinking about that. 
Yeah, and I did prioritize the one that I wanted to see most, which was Sonya. Yeah, Jack, we all thought of that. We just wanted to see if you would think of it, too. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> huh? I, I mean, I don't mind, but you actually enjoy it with me? I spent time today talking to Fihiko about the plan to capture Nagito. Looks like Fihiko and I grew a little closer. Over one of his favorite things to do, kidnapping. <laughs> Alright, let's give him some al non-alcoholic stuff, right? Give him binoculars. Do we actually- we have- no, we don't have any non-alcoholic wine left. Crap. Yeah, but you have- Oh, he likes the shirt. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't like this. So you're trying to suck up to me? You really think I take bribes? Well, it's fine if I accept this from you. Hey. Hey, Hajime, there's something I need to talk to you about. Come here. He seems more serious than usual. I was going to say, what if he kisses you? He seems more serious than usual. What's going on? Do it. Kiss him. And then he, like, bashes his nose into your cheek because he doesn't have any depth perception anymore. Oh, my God. so mean. I followed Fuhiko until we arrived at his cottage. <sighs> Are we gonna get his underpants? Yo, wait there. I got something from the supermarket. Ah, <laughs> uh, here it is. Cocaine! <laughs> He's like, We are going to go to the supermarket! <laughs> God. <laughs> he slammed a 60 ounce bottle in a glass right in front of me. That's Jesus, good. this guy doesn't even go for fucking 40s. He goes for 60s? It's gonna be this... like Cult 55 and like three zigzags. <laughs> Is it's this good. alcohol? Papa says, I hope it's four and we get them both. He goes, Yo, what the alcohol? <laughs> He's like, It's non alcoholic. Oh. Nah, it's just water. <gasps> Listen up. Underage drinking is not allowed under any circumstances. Let me tell you, this smells enough to make me pass out. I advise you to not go within 300 feet of the stuff. Don't be absurd. Hm. Regardless, it just wouldn't feel right with only a plastic bottle. Come on, take it. I'll take the glass, but I have no idea what the heck is going on. Uh, this is probably... Now cut is, your thumb and... Is this a... Is this a brotherhood cup? Is this a wholesome... <laughs> I mean, we're not... We're not here to... Underage, not drinking brotherhood vow? Oh my god. We're not Pop sitting it. here to sample the water. Be like, mm, 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 yes. <laughs> Under notes of fluoride. Then. God. Pop it says, bitches and blow it, boo you! Oh, never mind, cancel it. <laughs> Uh, could you talking? Could you be talking about a brotherhood cup? I feel like this is the kind of occasion that you would make a manly promise during. What? What? You don't wanna? No, it's nothing like that. I just think of you as more than a brother. <laughs> I just honestly never just... thought anything like this would ever happen to me. Can't be a lover to you if I'm your brother. <laughs> Why not, Bo? <laughs> <laughs> no, Vito. <laughs> Vito and I grew closer. Much closer. <laughs> Please stop. Banjo playing in the distance. <laughs> Why is this happening? <laughs> Obviously. Don't think about it too much. This isn't about making us real brothers or anything. Hey. Oh, well, then the, the whole thing is completely meaningless. What the fuck is the point of any of this, dude? <laughs> this is a promise to return alive. Together. I'll never die. I mean, I've already died once. And Pekko already saved that life, after all. <laughs> but you look like the type who dies easily, you know? So I thought it'd be good if we made a promise like this. Okay. <laughs> you look like a fucking weakling, so I might as well promise to, you know, try to protect you in some way. <laughs> hey, don't say something so ominous. Shut up! 
<laughs> That's why I'm saying that I'll give you half of my life. You guys are very silly. <laughs> you. I mean, you. Well, yeah. You're my very first friend. Aww. Thanks, Boo You. You're like number 10 or 12. <laughs> oh my god! Uh, even now, I'm still worried about whether I deserve to lead the clan. Well, there's nobody else. <laughs> yeah, right? By default, you are. <laughs> but I feel like that might change if I get out of here alive. So... So, Hajime, you better not die either. Fihiko, you... If you're unsure, then live. And live on. Search persistently, and keep looking for it. Aww. Looking for what? Looking for something. And then, <laughs> you should... You should be able to find it. Find what? You're right. I'll definitely try to find it, too. What? <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> Maybe, maybe it. it means like, uh, like a will to live or something. I don't know. <laughs> maybe he thinks that I'm his first friend, but I that I still have zero friends. Oh my god. Maybe he's looking for the eye of the tiger, the thrill of the fight. <laughs> <laughs> Ajime, you, you gotta cup. rise up to the challenge of your rival. <laughs> god. <laughs> Why? I accepted the cup and swallowed the water in one gulp. He could exactly. do the same and suddenly smash the cup afterward. Hell yeah. Psych, that was vodka. <laughs> <laughs> you stupid bitch, you should have seen your fucking face. Hajime <laughs> <laughs> gets like smashed, falls out of the fucking cottage into like the canal, like by the cottages. He just oh, starts God. choking. <laughs> He's like, you dumbass. I can see him doing that. <laughs> Some say shattering the cup's a bad omen, but I prefer it this way. I mean, if you break something, that means it can't be broken ever again. Hey. This is very Jewish of him. You obviously haven't right. learned a car- uh, obviously haven't ever owned a car for you, Hiko. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I mean... Th that license test is gonna be pretty tough now. <laughs> Oh, that's right. You want to be my underling when we get out of here? You mean like a little brother? Hell nah. <laughs> that doesn't really feel right. Jeez, you're pathetic. Fine. You just be my bro. Damn right. Well, anyway, we got to give it a roll and think of a way to get out of here. We each took a piece of the broken cup and put it in our pocket. We cut our hands like shit. <laughs> <laughs> I can feel a strong bond with Vihiko. Oh, wait, as long as I have this bond, I'll never give up. That's what I believe. So oh! From everybody else, you got their fucking underwear. From him, you get a broken piece of a cup. Well, <laughs> we might also get his underwear here in a moment. Fuhiko's report card has been updated based on our experience with him. We've never actually completed one of the guys, I don't think. Ever. That's right, we've never... So we don't actually know out. what happens. Uh, <laughs> oh my god, uh, Honor Jax. and humanity as an achievement. You just unlocked skill silver spoon. Give yourself a pat on the back. You've earned it. Oh, <laughs> very good. <laughs> you have Hell taken presents yeah. for Yuhiko's undergarments. You can check it from the present menu. <laughs> After trying to feed Hika for a while about various things, I returned to my room. Hey, you're my bro now. Here, take my underwear. What? Just do it. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Looks like I have some free time. What should I do with this, the last free time of the game? Knock all those Monokumas off the wall and put up your underwear collection. <laughs> oh, God. Pleasance. There we go. And Hoppish is like, lol, tiger print. 
Fuhiko's favorite underwear, despite that it doesn't seem like he wears them because he likes them. Apparently what? he doesn't have strong feelings toward his underwear. Is it say he doesn't, wear, he doesn't wear them? He just goes commando. <laughs> Is this how we find out that Fuyu has been freeballing this whole time? Oh my uh, god. Huh. They're like, let's go swim in the ocean. Everybody changing your swim trunks. He's like, I don't wanna. We did really bad, guys, getting the help fragments. What? what are you talking we got, about? Like, three people. Look at how many people there are, though. Look how many people we didn't get to know. Peko, um, Hiru, Yoko, we got, Nekamaru, we... Nagito, Byakia, Gundam, Teru We didn't get any of them. Oh, what's We there literally about could not be expected. Jesus. Okay, look what we've put into Ibuki and Chiaki. If you want to divide that up so you can get one fact about everybody else, that's fine. But in fact, we did fantastically. We got three people in 20 free time events. So we did no, we did as well as one could have been expected to do. All right, Jack, who do you want to go to? I guess, what, if you start off with one, I guess technically you start off with one. So you, if we were like perfectly doing this, you could get four people, right? Yeah. But you'd have to know in advance when people are unavailable because if you don't know that in advance, then uh, you know one one time that someone's unavailable that you thought they would could be available ruins the whole run. We did really fucking well. What do you want to talk to you, Jack? I mean, let's let's just go to Chiaki and be like, I'm sorry, Chiaki. This is where it ends. <laughs> Super difficult. Um, how should I lure out Nagito? Acting sexy definitely won't work. Yeah, he's more into guys. <laughs> <laughs> if uh, Hajime was zooming it, then it would work. I don't know, Chiaki. Yeah, I could be convinced. <laughs> Please stop. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I know uh, this just... is a trap, but you know. <laughs> just put some concealer on your boob. And then he'll be like, wait, that's not Chiaki. Hey, hey. <laughs> yeah, we, we already said that. I spent time today with Chiaki thinking of ways to lure out Nagito. Maybe you should like just Chiaki. practice that first idea with Hajime and see if that, uh, see if it Yeah, works. Hajime will just be there like, yeah, this definitely would not work for Nagito. <laughs> Please yeah. stop. No, you gotta try harder to do it again. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Why does this happen? Looks like we grew a little closer. Yeah. Have a present. You can have another gamepad thing. Hop itch is dying in the chat. <laughs> Very good. You gotta do it for at least tips 20 minutes because Nagito's got kind stop, of trouble getting stop, it up. Stop. Not me. <laughs> yeah, give her the tip, Izzy. Please stop. Just the tip. <laughs> Isn't that a pretty rare item? Thanks. Whoa! Did you see that? Yeah. They had little heart thingies. I like. I've never seen her do that before. Damn. What? I missed it. Oh my god! Did you really? I did really. Um, hmm. This seems a little. I feel like it might raise the flag. Oh, she fell asleep. <laughs> hmm. Every single time. I can't believe how quickly she falls asleep in such a short time. Samurai head, Statue of Liberty. Oh, don't shoot the beam there. This is bad. Zombie nation eating up humans. Is she dreaming about a game? I have no idea what kind of game she's talking about. Sorry. I think I was sleeping again. Were you playing a video game in your dream too? Yeah. It was fun because it was a shooting game. Oh, you wanna do some words end again, bruh? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. I see I like to so imagine you like that kinds of games. No, I, I like to imagine that Chiaki's like super just like Oh, hi, how's it going? You know, real, real soft voice. She gets the war zoning. You fucking bitch! <laughs> Just like super intense the whole time. I'm pretty all inclusive. I'll play anything from Space Invaders to the latest military shooters. 
Uh, I also like simulation games. Right now, I mainly play real-time strategy games, but I like turn-based ones too. Hey, hey. So, where do you want to go today? <laughs> yeah, uh, how about we go to the ranch today? Why are you laughing? I was just thinking that she might like civilization. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really like animals that much. Huh? Really? The ultimate gamer who plays every game possible and stays indoors playing games doesn't like animals? They're warm when you touch them, you know? That's a little scary. What? It's kind of hard to guess what they'll do next. Well? I'm better at games that use precise calculations, where success and failure is decided by numerical values. But... It's hard for me to play games where I have to manage relationships and guess what characters are feeling. I see. Maybe that has something to do with her upbringing. I don't want to do things Jackie will hate, but it feels lonely to just leave her like this. How about we look at the animals from far away? The ones at the ranch are pretty tame. You can even try to touch them if it looks safe. Hmm? Okay. I think... If you teach me lots of things, it'll probably be okay. I think. I read that as, if you touch me lots, it'll probably be okay. Oh my god. Hoppich has the final free time spent at the ranch. Chiaki, <laughs> might you be a Terminator? <laughs> <laughs> I was just thinking of freaking Dr. Phil. You're going to the ranch! <laughs> is she is relying that? on me? If so, that makes me happy. Dr. Phil's a person who... No, I mean, what's the the ranch reference? The ranch is where they go, like, try to fix people's behavioral problems. Oh. Rip. Chahi and I decided to walk to the ranch. Hmm. Oh my, it's a cow. I wonder if it's going to dance like the one in Dancing Eyes. That might be a little difficult. Hmm? Maybe. I should try touching it a little. I feel like Chiaki spent a lot of time in a small windowless room. Jesus. <laughs> yeah. Chiaki walked up to the cow and cautiously pet its back. The cow seemed not to mind and continued silently eating grass. <laughs> wow, it's really warm. Well, that's because it's alive. Hmm. I see. You're right. Tell me more about this alive. <laughs> <laughs> Unlike humans, animals don't mind being touched that much, so that might make it easier for me. If you touch a person, something is born from that interaction, right? Repulsion, anticipation, whatever. I'm nervous about stuff like that. It makes me think I'm better off not doing anything unnecessary. Unnecessary. Like, it's better if I just stay an innocent bystander for as long as I can. Chucky's feelings seem a little odd, but I do understand where she's coming from. Oh, that's illuminating. I hope one day she can touch not just cows, but people too. Uh, you know, if we milk this cow, then we can milk you. I'm sure the fresh milk must be really tasty. What was that? Okay. What's the part? <laughs> Jesus. She's like, milk comes from cows? Yeah. Milk like, <laughs> this cow? Huh? Uh, you know, that milk comes from cows, right? What, what is, is this? Like co fuel or something? What, what, is oh! Oh. <laughs> what is this conversation? What do you oh, mean no. from? Ch Chiaki is very sheltered. Milk is milk, right? You know, if you pull a cow's udders, milk comes out. You only need one cow to get as much milk as you want. Huh? As much as you want? <laughs> but if you try to cut open a milk bottle, bottle, a cow comes out of it, right? Excuse me, Chiaki? And it dances, right? I knew it! It's definitely dancing eyes. I don't know what that reference is, but... What? Are you okay? What kind what? of game is she talking about? I explained how milk works to Chiaki in detail. I am just... what? 
I'm, Why I'm are there... concerned. I'm concerned about her. <laughs> yeah, what the hell? Why are there so many things she doesn't know? As usual, Chucky is full of mysteries. Uh... Yeah, because report card has been updated based on your experience with her. Wow. Check with All these mysteries that we've... For, like... It's a big old dent or something? <laughs> <laughs> All these mysteries of Chiaki, uh, and we're never going to find out anything more about them. <laughs> Chiaki started to feel sleepy from playing too much, so after sending her off, I returned to my room. I'm going to go with that, uh, yeah, she spent a lot of time in a small windowless room theory. <laughs> it, it seems a little weird, right? Yeah. It's super weird. How does she not know? She's never played Cow Milker Simulator. <laughs> simulator let her down. Oh my god. Look like it's starting to get dark. Oh, hello? Who is it? Michonia? Hey, it's you. The doorbell. Is someone here? Instinctively, my entire body tensed up. I knew it was probably someone like Sonia. Or maybe Kazuichi. But regardless, I was nervous. And it is Nagito, and he's got a knife. It's gonna... Yeah. Not that I can help it. I mean, so much has happened since we arrived at this island. Who are you talking to, Hajime? Myself, and I'm saying it out loud. And now not. While mumbling to myself, I quietly opened my cottage door. <laughs> he literally is oh, mumbling to oh, hello there, Hajime. Oh, no! hell no. Yeah, How? I knew it was going to be him. How? I knew it was going to be him. What is he? He I literally said, he literally said, fuck off, please. And now he but, wants to talk. But Hajime, it's nighttime, and I'm lonely. <laughs> he just wanted the attention on his terms. Uh, you didn't spend any of your free times with me, and I know that was the last time. He's one, going to so kill I'm us. Here. He's going to kill us with a knife. Do you remember what I said? You remember when I said we would be the last murder victim? Oh my god. There's no yeah. way. There's no way. Listen to the fucking music. They can't kill. They can't kill the main character. You've already saw perspective. Yeah, yeah that's never that happened again. before. When has that happened? Uh, spoilers, it. close your ears, Dan. Oh, whatever. Dang and Rampa won. That's not Dude, true. Dude, they're playing what Trap by the is. Ocean Scent. That no? means some bad shit's about to happen. What do you is, want? I, will yeah. I will point something out. This game is already established once that we can switch perspectives. Just putting that out no! there. No! Good oh, lord, that's darker. Oh, that's darker that's yet. A, I don't know what you're talking about. In Danganronpa what, 1, you Nagito get accused of murder, remember? Yeah. Uh, and... That's not... But I didn't... That has nothing to do with being killed. The main character literally being permanently well, killed. Well, Nagito becomes the main character. Are you shitting me? No! <laughs> There's no way. <laughs> Only Nagito? There's no way. Just Nagito. Stop! <laughs> oh, my God. Nagito. Oh, dude. Why is he here? I I'm going to hate this if they make him a murderer. I'm going to hate. I'm gonna quit the stream. <laughs> <laughs> Kazuichi was I, right. I hate this. I oh my god. I should have seen ahead. See I should have checked want. ahead. And so no, I know. it's better because you're better. No, you're blind, I don't know what's like, going know. on. <laughs> No! You need, you need <laughs> emoji Jump out the window, your, quick! Your yeah, that's... A, what? You need an afraid emoji for your avatar. Well, the third one is supposed <laughs> to be more afraid, but I guess it's like a shocked one. See? Uh, the shocked emote. <laughs> God. Hi, uh, Jack. Oh, I was just trying to look for the shocked emote. <laughs> oh, it's, yeah, it's a very slight... I better ask him what he wants. Hot bitch is dying because you tried to leave. <laughs> 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 Hurry! I guess we're switching rooms. That's fine. You can have my Monokuma statues. Bye. <laughs> yeah, take the plushies. Run! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. If he's actually, though. You guys are scaring me. It'll be fine. We don't know. Dude, can no I... Idea. Can I... I have to use the bathroom. <laughs> no, don't go in the shower. That's where people get... This fucking psycho <laughs> music plays. He pulls back the curtain. And... <laughs> Violin plays and you go, ah! <laughs> what do you want, right. you freak? Touch him. You, what are you doing here? You sure ask weird questions. You're in my house! <laughs> I mean, you guys all have business with me, right? Huh? Well, uh, Chiaki hadn't invited me to the lobby. She said she had something she wanted to talk to me about. 
<laughs> Everyone put her up to that, right? I don't know. Maybe she should have done the sexy thing. <laughs> her plan failed, run! Damn it, she already... <laughs> already found out about our plan. No. It looks like that's a bingo, huh? I sure am lucky. <laughs> that's, what is the phrase? That's, that's a, a bingo. bingo. <laughs> <laughs> is that a reference for real? Yeah, it's a reference to Inglorious yeah. Bastards. Are you kidding me, Izzy? No, Are you I just didn't. I just me? didn't think they would make a no, reference uh, no, because I it's think she's oh, actually, is the oh. game making the reference. Yeah, I, think I think so. Come on, Jag. You think I would forget that movie? Yeah, I'm saying I do. I'm I'm surprised because I know the movie was popular here, but not in Japan. Like mm. they they would make a reference. <laughs> It'll be the localizers too. Yeah, well. like it's some sort of Japanese reference, but they don't. They're like, ah, we'll just do this one instead. <laughs> Hmm. Yeah, but it's good timing. I have some business with you guys, too. Yeah, like oh. what? Killing? You do? If everyone's already at the lobby, that saves me a lot of trouble. Hey. See, I just grabbed this machine gun. <laughs> oh, God. And I want you to come to the lobby, too. Even though you're not directly involved with the plan. You even know that. I see. Yeah, just as I thought. You were left out, huh? Uh, that's wow. understandable. Hajime, you're so stupid. You literally just told him. Since you're the only one who isn't an ultimate, you've basically been left out from the start. Bitch. Now, now. <laughs> I'm only joking. Don't make such a scary face. I like how he just showed up and, like, played your ass immediately. Like, Hajime yeah. just gave well, him that's... every fucking suspicion, like, confirmed it just one after another. <sighs> no, you chose smart. That's the problem. Hajime ain't bright. It's smart enough to figure out the trials, but not to be one step ahead. No, that was us. No, that's what I said. Hajime is smart, but he's not smart enough to be one step ahead. Because now you figured out the trials. Hajime didn't do it. We did it. Fuck him. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. Your joke isn't funny. Someone like me. <laughs> you shouldn't take me so seriously. See? Oh well. Anyway, let's hurry over to the lobby. I don't know the details of your plan, so I'm actually looking forward to it. I wonder what you guys are going to do to me. <laughs> when we first arrived at this island, we were friends who explored this place together. So let's go already. Hmm. Fine, let's go. Yep. <laughs> yeah. He's actually kind of friendly overall, even though he, he says he made the joke again of like, you're a loser, you're not an ultimate. But he's just like, hey, don't take me too seriously. And this is the nicest he's spoken to us since before Chapter 4. Uh, he just sounds like he has a Like, it sounds manic. Like, whatever he's doing, it's it's giving him a high. And he's just being whatever. Like, he doesn't care. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't know what he's thinking, but as long as we capture him, we'll have the advantage. I won't let him do as he pleases anymore. Why are you out here? Go away. Can we go in your room? What? <laughs> you need something for my cottage? <laughs> <laughs> you go to your hotel lobby, right? Let's go. We don't want to keep the others waiting. Oh my fucking god. Get out of god here. Damn god damn it, game. <laughs> Leave the me fucking alone. Footsteps. Dude, was that him in front too? He's everywhere. <laughs> No. Uh, hello. I don't know what you guys are planning, but like I said, I also need to talk to you guys about something. Isn't that a strange coincidence? It's like there's something we both need to tell each other. Bye. Push him in the water. Push him in the water and drown him. This is like a situation where a boyfriend and girlfriend get together and the girlfriend blurts out at the same time as the boyfriend, I love you, and the boyfriend's like, we need to break up. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Please. Shaki has summoned Nagito, and the plan has already started. Fuhiko and Akane should be waiting inside for Nagito. Jeez. What happened, Hajime? What are you so nervous about? I'm not nervous. <laughs> <laughs> you're a terrible actor. Oh well, if you're gonna slow down like that, I'll go inside first. Thank you. 
As I hesitated in front of the door, Nagito walked past me and entered the hotel lobby. What do you think is going to happen? They're going to jump him. Biff, pow, zam. <laughs> That's when it happened. Um, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it's, he's gonna sass him again. Don't judge us for this, but we're gonna tie you up. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna judge the hell out of you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right? Like You're gonna be so judged, sailor. <laughs> Jesus. There's no use struggling! What is Kazuichi doing? Like, he's in the background he's like, Hey guys, I'm- commanding. I'm directing it <laughs> over here. But I'm not struggling. Bruh. Huh? What, what the hell? You're being strangely cooperative. Who cares? Just tie him up before it's too late. You guys are really disappointing. How long are you going to continue behaving so short-sightedly? Hoppitch oh, says Nagito is obviously very bitter that he's the smartest student with the least of talents. Rap. You gotta look at the big picture, you know. Huh? What are you talking about? It's fine if you don't understand. You can just see the end without knowing. Now then, let's begin. The beginning of the end of Jabberwock Island. Well, that's not ominous. That's when it happened. Out of the corner of my eye, I saw a bright light. What? Oh, fuck! Oh! Oh, Jesus. oh my the god. The shook. We went flying! <laughs> like, uh, Kazuichi was Kazuichi. Er, sorry, Kazuichi. Wow, oh that is God. very reminiscent of Holy Game 1. Shit. Yeah, like, fucking... <laughs> Rip. <laughs> the Stimkey character went flying. An explosion of darkness overtook me, and I was unable to see anything. I probably lost consciousness. Shortly after the impact, I managed to open my eyes slightly. Whoa! There's something going on. Are the words that left my mouth, but they vanished before they ever reached my ears. Holy shit, dude. Oh my god, he broke dude, the he monitor. He said that as if he was the one that set this bomb. Well, I think he figured out, because remember there's that bomb in the middle of the island that's always been counting down? I think he worked out what's about to happen. Huh, they were drowned out by the sound of terrifying laughter. This, like, um... I think, Sasha, you've played Paper Mario, right? Yeah. Like, that background there on the side where the smoke is going through, like, that's what it reminds me of. Yeah, I know what you mean. It's, like, very, like, two and a half D. Mm hmm It's fucking cool looking. I looked up and I saw the source of that laughter. It was Nagito. Jesus Christ. What was that Christ. fucking bomb thing that was in the middle, <laughs> like, the, on a timer? Was he just watching that? Yeah, I think so. That's what's Holy gonna happen. Holy shit. Yeah, see, I told you. He had that manic energy. He was doing something. It's amazing! These amazing fireworks surely befit the beginning of the end! Dude, your, your hair is gonna set on fire, bro. <laughs> it's over. This is the end. The killings are done for good. Scapegoating the weak in the name of justice, while fearing when the others will stab you in the back. I don't know if you guys can hear it, but you can tell that this voice actor does only good characters. <laughs> like, <laughs> he's having, like, a really fun time with it. He's having way too much fun. Yeah, like, because yes, he, he be this bad guy. Is, I looked it up, like, about the voice actor. He apparently, like, this is one of the only roles that he got to do something more antagonistic. That's funny. So he so, just went like completely over the top. Oh yeah, like he did. <laughs> he did four takes of that laugh, and apparently it, it like destroyed his throat. He couldn't go <laughs> into recording the next two weeks. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, he threw he threw uh, like all of it into it. It's crazy. This game of self righteous hypocrisy ends now. 
And to do that, I will destroy Jabberwock Island. How are you oh, going he, to do that? Did he blow up the like countdown in the middle? No, did he actually it, do it that? hit the lobby. No. Oh, well, I'm wondering. I wonder. Okay, I was wondering how what he actually blew up. He blew up the lobby, right? Like that's. That has to I don't be. Know. Hmm. What do you mean? That was just a little demonstration. Yeah, see? That's okay. the beginning of the end. The actual bomb I'm going to use isn't nearly as weak. Actual bomb? I've set up a large number of bombs in a certain area of the island. If all those bombs explode, the force will be enough to wipe out this entire island. Well, what the hell are you saying? If you do that, of course, I doubt we'll walk away from this unharmed. What, he's gonna kill all of them? Isn't that against Seems the- like Isn't that against the rules? Uh, <laughs> I, think I don't think he cares right now. Is, uh, well, I, I mean, Monica like, like well, Monokuma's gonna yeah. have to stop him, is what I'm saying. Like, he can't- he can't oh, go yeah. against the rules. Yeah, it seems like it seems like it. But Monica gonna drop the ball on this. No other way. The actor is expected to leave the stage during the finale. Dude, calm the fuck down. Is <laughs> this bastard serious? Nagito, please stop. Uh, are you crazy or something? No, that's not it. I'm not the crazy one here. The one who's really crazy is... Monokuma? Yeah. My, my, this guy. Emergency! Emergency! <laughs> I'm totally shocked. Seriously, I'm totally shocked. That's all I can say about this turn of events. <laughs> <laughs> the bombs they set are timed. They're set to go off in two days at noon. Every time that laugh goes off, Jesus Christ. Hmm? I've prepared so many powerful bombs that the one that just exploded doesn't even compare. According to my calculations, they're powerful enough to blow up an entire island. Which means in two days at noon, this island is destined to sink in the sea. I don't know if you've thought of this, but there are five islands! <laughs> what are you <laughs> on? Grape <laughs> Island and Grape Island are the same island. <laughs> are you serious? Why would you tell him their, your plan? Just move to the other island. I think, I, I think his thing is he wants to try and he, he's pushing the ultimate hope idea of like, let's just destroy everything. Give you give us some time to kind of overcome that. Yeah. I don't think he cares about them anymore. I'm not exactly. I don't know. He's kind of going crazy. Do you really think I go this far for a joke? Yes. You. What, where, where did you set him up? Oh, you got a little bit of dust there on your boob, Akane, I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't tell you. How about it? It'd be easy to leave you on your own, but it just wouldn't be fair if I did that. So how about this? If the traitor comes forward and reveals their identity to me, I'll tell them where I hid the bombs. You're still on that? Dude. That's the only thing he cares about. Oh, look, he broke the the window. I just noticed that he broke the... Yeah, all <laughs> the, That cutout? Oh, no, it's a tree. I th straight up thought that the glass was broken in the cut of a tree. Uh, <laughs> That's just a tree in the background. Huh? Emergency! What in the world is going on? Is everyone all right? Hey! Come on, come on. Don't get in the way. Nagito is in the middle of weeding out the traitor. Oh, uh, Nagito, what are you planning to do? <laughs> do I really have to say it? Um, it, it's no use. I mean, the traitor shouldn't be able to reveal their identity on their own. Why? Hmm. What does that mean? Oh, come on, Nagito. It's because they I forgot. Don't remember that they're the traitor, dumbass bitch. What if it's Nagito's the traitor? It could be. It very well it's, could be. It would explain why you can plant fucking bombs around and no one notices. Do I really have to say it? Ba -ba -ba 
them. <laughs> my, my, you guys are totally dying each other and letting sparks fly. I'm getting all hot and bothered. Don't just stand there. Why don't you stop him? Huh? Don't stop him. Why don't you stop him? The rules, remember? The rules, remember? The same black oh, can only kill a maximum of two people. <laughs> <laughs> He's just saying you it at the same the time. Island. Island. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It's <laughs> gonna kill way more than just two people. I see. You sure have a good memory. Ultimate memory. Like you said, if anything breaks everything. that rule, I'll have to punish them severely. Oh yeah, you can kill everybody. Oh my god, that's so bad. Oh, you fucking... But that's only when someone breaks that rule, right? Shut the fuck up. I don't think I will. <laughs> you can't punish someone for breaking a rule before they've broken it, right? That's right! Yep, saying you're gonna break the rules isn't against the rules. Too bad! So, right now, there's no way I can punish this. Okay, <laughs> but what about the no. Destroying too much school on this island? property. Look, yeah, he broke You're the... not allowed to be violent? He broke That's the a monomy monitor. rule, not a Monokuma rule. Oh, what Wait, the hell? Well, that's not true because they followed the monomy rule about no littering. That's a well, monomy the rule. The students chose to, not anybody else. Nope, no, that was actually an important detail in Murder 2. I don't get it anymore. <laughs> I think that they choose to interpret the rules of whatever best, best suits them at the time. Monica was probably happy to see this destruction going off. It always yields to the narrative. What the hell? What the hell? Look at all what the smoke the and shit. Jesus. Yeah, <laughs> if you don't advance, I'm gonna die of smoke inhalation. So <laughs> and punishments always happen afterwards, not before. That's just the rules of society, right? Hey. Not even so. There's no need to worry about that in the first place. As long as the traitor comes forward, it's gonna all be resolved peacefully. So he's gonna push him into a corner until what? Like, the, what, if they can't remember, then they're screwed. Well, right. it kind of pushes Monami into a specific corner, because if Monami knows how they lost their memories, she can potentially give them back. And so Monami's like, well, crap, everyone's going to die. And so he's, re he's really kind of targeting Monami with this. Really? You, I think Nagito believes that the traitor knows who they are. I don't think, well, I think with what Monami said, if you take what Monami said at face value, which, you know, okay, maybe not. Um, I would go with, the, I would go with like, that seems like a very logical thing of like, well, the traitor probably just doesn't remember that they're a traitor. Well, the problem lies is if does Monami lie? Does she lie to people? I think she's wrong a lot. If she's guessing about something that she doesn't know, she's just flat out wrong. I don't think she lies. Not and like... Hobbit says, "I wonder why he wants the traitor." And that's the one thing on this th island that he does not know. He knows everything else. I think that's why he just wants mm. to know what's going on. Uh, Nagito knows yeah. about the ultimates. He knows about what's you know, that document that we haven't seen yet. I think he just wants to know. He can't figure it out. <laughs> this is exciting. It'll all be fine. I'm pretty sure everything will work out in the end. After all the time we spent together, I believe in you guys. <laughs> and more than anything, I believe in my ultimate luck. So it's definitely going to be all right. After he said that, now you two walked away. He just walked away. Couldn't even stop him. Just I felt afraid of Nagito. The madness emanating from Nagito's body was seeping into my bones. I never expected him to go this far. We haven't heard from Chiaki in a while. That's because she died in the blast. <laughs> Where's the body <laughs> discovery announcement? Oh my fucking... Well, then stop! we could just vote him off. Stop! That would... Then we could just vote him off because everybody would know he did it, and then just be the end. There's of it. no way. No, I was just joking. Stop. No, what Caleb said. Oh. <sighs> Nagito's so reliable. I don't even. I don't have to do anything because he's shaking things up. That bastard. I'll never forgive him. Damn it. Damn it. Is he fucking serious about using those bombs? Hey, hey. As long as the traitor comes forward, he'll say where the bombs are, right? Is is that his goal? Damn it. 
Then I'm begging you guys. It doesn't matter who does it. Someone just has to come forward. Hey, I'm begging you guys. Hmm. No matter how long we waited, no one was willing to come forward. What Nagito said yesterday. I'll weed out the traitor, even if it cost me my life. I finally understand what he meant. Nagito took this entire island hostage and created a situation where the traitor has to come forward. That is Nagito's goal. But what is he planning to do if the traitor doesn't come forward? Is he really going to blow up the entire island? Huh. Um, Hoppage says, I didn't have to do anything from Monokuma. And uh, just make a file with info, the prize of a luck-based game, like, you know, the Russian roulette. Monokuma's <laughs> the biggest shitter ever. My yeah. motto is to do a good deed every day. When I was at a bar and shouted, can I get a Sam? The female bartender happily answered, sure thing. Makes me so happy when someone else is ha this happy. Doing a good deed every day is awesome. But inside... That one probably thought I was a loser for sitting alone at the cheap bar in the middle of the night. Damn it, I can't keep up with this crap. Hey, sweet cheeks, give me another Sam. Huh? Not a Sam Adams, I'm talking about a raw salmon. And here's some good news for you. I have imbued the smell of vanilla into the Monokuma plushies. It's effective aromatherapy, I'll definitely calm everyone's nerves if they're agitated. Available in the near future. <laughs> That's it for Monokuma Shopping Corner. Man, he's really trying to sell all his merch. <laughs> big bong, big bong. Ahem. Hope Speak Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an announcement to make. Good morning, everyone. Looks like today is going to be another perfect tropical day. Now then, let's show some enthusiasm and make sure to give it our all today. I've been resting since the explosion yesterday, but my body still hurts. A dull, metallic sound is ringing in my ears, and the back of my head feels hot. I can't think straight. But I can't afford to spend the whole day resting. I immediately left my cottage. Oh my gosh, I got hit by some dyslexia right there. I immediately felt my cottage is what I was thinking. <laughs> <laughs> is he not using his room? Hey! Hmm. Nagita's goal is to hold... Hold us and this ho island hostage in order to make the traitor come forward. But if he can't pull that off, what's he planning to do? Is he really going to blow up the whole island? I can't believe they had something new to say. Hey, it's you, Rat. You're the traitor, aren't you? Fuck off. What the hell are you saying? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, just admit it already. If you don't, we're all gonna die. I'm not the traitor. Damn it. I'm begging you, it doesn't matter who admits it. Just save me. Oh Why my god, you're so bad. Me? Yeah. Get a hold of yourself, Kazuichi. Complaining won't change anything, okay? Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> We're being told that a lot this stream. <laughs> <laughs> I know that, but what else can we do? We need to think about that with the others. So let's hurry up to... So okay. let's hurry over to the restaurant. <laughs> okay, Jack, do you need like a drink of water or something? <laughs> I don't know. I have water. Hoppage says it suggests to first have Nagito as planned. Yeah, can we start <laughs> with that? Jeez. Runs I away. <laughs> I forgot. No. Damn it. I was hoping. Maybe. Yo! No, it's you. You're covered in sweat. I was looking for Nagito. This traitor stuff bugs the crap out of me. I won't forgive you. 
I just have to beat him up. Make him tell us where the bombs are. But I can't find him anywhere. Is he hiding or something? Damn it. Damn it. I'm starting to get hungry. Maybe I should go back to the restaurant. Why don't you use your stupid handbook? <laughs> Akane looks pretty frustrated. I guess that makes sense. After what happened yesterday. Damn it. What's going to happen to us now? Where do you even get all that shit? From the military base? Oh yeah. I mean, That's where he was at. Jockey. Where are you? Can we even see? I don't think we can even see where he went to. Yeah, we don't know where he's at. Yeah, see, they don't know where- they can't find him. Shit. Are you in here? <laughs> How's anybody gonna tell him if he's not around? Don't know. This is where everything started, somehow. It feels like it's already been such a long time. Um, Hoppish says, Akane, take the L and in Nagito. We'll make you a bronze statue of your next Sakura. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh, jeez. Look at like, I tried playing this game and it didn't work. Oh, Jesus Christ. Are they really coming back to hang out in here? I guess so. Looks like the arcade machine was too close to the explosion. I don't think it's going to work anymore. Chucky's probably the most upset about it. Is this broken? I want to make sure, but it'd be annoying if Monokuma accuses me of breaking it. I better just leave it alone. Look at anything else here? What is this here? Even the reception desk was caught in the explosion. It's not really a problem since no one is using it, but it sure is messed up. Nothing else, huh? Does this still work? No, it's the same make sure. Thing. Da, 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 da. Same thing. All right. Well, what do you guys think they're gonna do next? They're gonna probably have to get. So I, I my big bet is somebody's gonna get their memories back. Well, I'll be right back in two seconds. And you can debate if what they're gonna do. <laughs> Best guess of who the traitor is, go. Nagito. Jack. Mm. Chucky. I'm thinking that they're gonna actually pull it. I think that uh, Hajime might actually still be the traitor. That is also really, really plausible. It would make sense. It just really kind of... I, I think we'd have more information who it might be if we knew what Nagito had actually read in the file. Because he probably has his suspicions over who it is, but the question kind of lies is just, like, he's not obviously not able to make a determination just reading the file. Yeah. I mean, my gut reaction goes, the tra like, if the traitor is alive, it's probably Hajime. If the traitor isn't alive, it's Byakuya. That's my thought process. Because he's the he's the standout here. He's the only one from the first game that we've seen. That is true. Like, why is he here? What's going on? You know, I don't understand what's happening. This is an oddball thought, but maybe it connects to why, like, so many of these characters are, like, similar to Danganronpa 1 characters. Could be. Because we know is that right? Like a, a ton of them are just kind of like not reskins, but like obvious references to old characters. Yeah. Um, Hopper says I have a bad feeling about Nagato hating us. I wanted to know who it is, who is who is not us because what then? Hmm. That's a good point. No, yeah, I'm certainly sure. capable of doing some shit about it. I mean, this is what I was saying earlier. It's like, if you know how to set off those explosives and shit like that, like, that military base had some scary looking stuff there, where if you understand how to operate some of that, it's like, that's not a small amount of ordnance sitting in there. 
and the fact that he's plant had had enough time to go plant fucking bombs all around the island it kind of speaks to that yeah climbing him up's not the worst idea it's a little too late now he's already planted the bombs uh Sasha, who did you think was the traitor um i think it's nagito how come because fucking what's her name monami seemed really distressed that the traitor would not be able to come forward on their own and Nagito is kind of a standout in terms of, uh, let's just call it conduct. <laughs> <laughs> it could be. It could be like a whole Mekon thing where he acts like this, but then like he ended up joining the Foundation or whatever, and that actually helped fix him. And he just doesn't remember that part. It's totally the opposite of Mekon. I, I think it's Nagito, too. What did you say, Jack? Jack? I think Jack was in a Nagito I... boat as well. No, I, I said Chiaki. Oh. What? Why do you think Chiaki is the trainer? She didn't even know what milk is. <laughs> <laughs> Are you being serious right now? That's not really why, but she she has her shit together. And? So that means kind you're the trainer. Kind of a Kyoko vibe sort of a thing, I think is what he's going for. Yeah. Kyoko wasn't the trainer. Wow. I know, but the, but the, but she was like this ultimate like you know investigator stuff or whatever. She's quietly staring at the arcade machine with sad eyes. Good morning, Hajime. This arcade machine break. Oh. What could have happened? It was too close to the explosion. I guess it couldn't take it. Man. This arcade machine was really popular, and it was so tough that even an elephant couldn't damage it. But if it's broken, I can't do anything about it. I guess that's just how it is. Her shoulders are sagging pretty low. She's sad, girl. Yo! Yo, Hajime, how you feeling? Not good, but not so bad that I can't move. Huh. Then you're okay. This is bad. I'm not okay at all. My ears are seriously ringing. Damn it! My eardrum's definitely ruptured. I need to hurry and have a doctor look at it. Well, yeah, you were, like, right next to the explosion. Yeah, he did get, like, gnashed by it, to his mm. credit. Thanks for the tinnitus. Um, so, what should we do now? However... What can we do? Hmm. Yeah, troubling. The traitor would just come forward. This problem would be resolved in no time. Spooky motherfucker. Nagato, <laughs> where did you... Hey. This pops in. <laughs> Good morning. I came to motivate you guys. You're just laying around. I mean, imminent bomb is probably a good enough motivation. <laughs> Didn't I tell you yesterday that the bombs would start to go off two days at noon? Has he seriously not figured out that the traitor probably doesn't remember? I Like well, I said, I don't think he believes that. Well, you've got one day left. Come on, you better hurry. I mean... Uh, uh, hurry? I'm not the one who has to come forward. The traitor does, right? Well, that's probably true. But even if this does depend on the traitor, your attitudes aren't admirable at all. Isn't that right? <laughs> I mean, real hope is when you confront a hopeless difficulty that's standing before you, right? And despite that, you guys are all ready to give up. What does that mean? Or is this your limit? If so, it makes me laugh that I think I ever called you symbols of hope. <laughs> You bastard. You better knock it off. Now, now. <laughs> now, now. Keep your shirt on. Or, well. Or don't. <laughs> I took the time to come bring you guys a valuable hint. Wouldn't it be bad if I changed my mind? No. <laughs> mm -hmm. Give us the hint or I'll punch you. Hint? <laughs> oh. Alright, let's go down the line from left to right without Nagito. Um, 
It's best if we hurry and get the hint. I think. Akane looks like she's ready to tackle him. Hey, hey! It's okay if I punch him, right? 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 Do it. Do Calm it. down, Akane. <laughs> we might feel better after punching Nagito, but if we can't find the bombs, we'll... I won't forgive you. Then I'll just beat the crap out of him after we find the bombs. Damn it. Damn it. Nagito is holding all the cards here. You serious? He said hint just now, right? Right? Let's hurry up and find out what it is. What do you want, Sonya? For now, we should learn what the hint is. If so, we can find the bombs. I'm searching for a traitor who does not even exist. Oh, Sonya. <laughs> Someone say hint. Did Naito say hint? I feel like didn't he just say that though? I don't know. Everyone's been saying it. It's kind of smart, actually. What? Well, because now he just has to figure out who says let's look for the bombs and who says let's look for the traitor. And whoever, like, like the people who aren't interested in finding the traitor and just want to find the bombs are still suspects to him. Yeah. But I mean, that's more of a concern to them than the other stuff. Right. But like, if you're the traitor, you're going to want to find the bombs. You're not going to want to find the traitor. Well, right now, Akane, Fuyu, and Kazuichi want the bombs to be turned off. As we doesn't even care who it is, he just wants somebody to come forward and admit that they're a traitor. <laughs> yeah, he yeah, just true. wants to live. Nagito, what's your hint? I'm glad. You know, you finally have hope. That makes me happy. Hey! Uh, who freaking cares about that? Hurry up and tell us what the hint is. Well... Oh, it's about the bomb's hiding place. It is somewhere you guys haven't been before. <laughs> Inside the ancient temple. Mm -hmm. Somewhere we've not been before. Final dead room. I don't need any hints. Just tell us the answer. If you don't, I'll make you spit it out. Hey, 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 hey! Uh, stop it! What are we gonna do if he sets off another bomb? Yep. Good judgment. Hey. If you guys have time to pick a fight with me, then you should start searching for the bombs already. Then I'll just crush you to pieces later. Wow. That was scary. Uh, why did you give us a hint? See? Well, if the traitor sees their friends working hard, they may feel inclined to come forward, you know? You. Who cares? The traitor might not even exist. All we need to do is find the damn bombs. Hm. Let's go. Take care. I... No, oh, by the way, I'll be waiting here, so if you want to reveal yourself, come see me anytime. Right? <laughs> Mr. I'm Miss Traitor. Hmm. It's me. I'm Miss Traitor. <laughs> <laughs> we left the restaurant as Nagito's muffled laughter trailed behind us. Suck. <laughs> it's fucking Halloween pumpkin shit. Why? Kazuichi, why did you stop me? Huh? What are you talking about? If you hadn't stopped me, I could have crushed Nagito to pieces. Bastard! You're too fired up, dumbass. Calm the fuck down, at least. Everyone. More important, let's all head out. Let's all head over to the ancient ruin. Hmm. Huh? The ruin? Please listen. Nagito said that the bombs are hidden somewhere we have never been before. So just as I thought. If that is the case, the inside of that ruin is the only place I can think of. Well. No, there was one other place, too. What is it again? That castle at the amusement park? What's his name? What's the name, Jack? Oh, yeah. Castle Japanese for Mouse. 
<laughs> Close enough. Are you talking about that Natsumi castle? Natsumi a... castle? Stop. Isn't Natsumi a, a game developer? <laughs> uh, I don't know. It sounds like uh, from Doki Doki. That's what I was thinking. Like <laughs> mm, Natsuki. Yeah. You don't get it at all. Freaking means Nezumi Castle, Baka. <laughs> <laughs> then we have those two places to choose from. But we won't be able to enter the ancient ruin without a password. What should we do? Like. Uh, password, huh? I'm guessing we still don't have any clues to that. Hey, hey. That probably goes for Nagito, too. You wouldn't be able to enter it without the password either, right? If that's the case. It's hard to think that the bombs were set inside the ancient ruin, right? So, we should try going to Nizumi Castle first. Are we screwed? Yeah. Huh. But isn't that dangerous? I mean, what if that was Nagato's trap all along? Jeez. Manakuma's trap, Manami's trap, now Nagato's trap. If we keep worrying about shit like that, we won't get anything done, dumbass. You. You're totally fired up too. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he says two, but it reads three. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Jack. Please stop. Hey. <sighs> anyway, we should try going there at least. We don't have time to stand around doing nothing. Right. Full speed ahead. Obviously. Full speed ahead. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we'll tackle Nazumi Castle first. Are you really inside here, bro? I guess I should have taken the stairs, huh? Hajime, what are you doing down there? Oh no! Oh! She pooped out an egg! Bye! <laughs> Menacing focus Whoa. skill. Oh, and shit. a century potpourri. And <laughs> a shitload of coins. Wow. wow, if you just give them crappy hope, like you, you go give you the crap that you get, <laughs> then you get good shit back. That's awesome. It took a long time though. We did that Usami one forever. You're supposed yeah. to walk around more, and we're skipping ahead, so... Because we're like, let's finish it! We've been here for a while. I'm the traitor. Do we know where the last mono bear is? Huh? No. Are you the traitor, Hajime? Yes. Jeez. They should be like, here. yes, no, and then if you say yes, then the game that ends. That would be so cool. Oh my God. That'd be cool. What if you said... What if you said yes and, uh, and Naga just pulled out a fucking Glock? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> no, you're not. I'm the traitor. You, you lied to me. <laughs> you're not, right? There's no way Reserve Corps student would ever be part of the Future Foundation. Hey. Right? It's impossible. I'm not the traitor, but not because of the reason you Do said. No. Fuck you. <laughs> hey, Hajime, as a reserve course, dude, the only thing you can do is become food for the others, you know? Oh, yeah? Well, how do you explain Teru Teru? <laughs> so try working a little harder. That way the trader will feel like coming forward. You're such an ass. Wow. You don't even know? He literally no. won't accept us saying we're the trainer. Well, we didn't uh... even say that. He just is saying, like... Well, I mean, yeah, he didn't say anything, but if Hajime stayed completely silent, he was like, oh, you must be the traitor because you're the coming forward. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Where are we, <laughs> Where are we going? I bless God bless We're going you. to the castle. Oh, right. We're going to not Disney castle. I think I'm going the wrong way again. I do know. Jack's falling asleep. He needs more Jack. entertainment. What? <laughs> it's on island four, right? Uh, yeah, it has to be. Yeah. Uh huh. Did you know that you can reach a level like ninety nine or a hundred, like unlocking? 
Holy Let's shit. close to that. You're already given birth. It's another rabbit. Chippy me. Chippy me. Aww. Whoa. She tried standing. <laughs> it's cute. Don't poop, though. No pooping. Ever? Yeah, never. Never, ever. <laughs> Just hold it for <laughs> however many hours we play this game. <laughs> Hey, what's up? Damn it! Hey, don't you think this is definitely a trap? Like, once we go inside the castle, kaboom! No, I don't think that's gonna happen. Nagito wants to weed out the traitor, not kill us all at the same time. Why not both? I mean, if he was just gonna murder everybody, he would have done it yesterday. Yeah. Well, that's true, but he's crazy, you know? Anyway, we need to keep trying and head over there. Ugh. In the end, we still have to go. Anyway, let's go to Nozumi Castle. We spent, like, no time on this island. We have no business here. I need to hurry over to Nozumi Castle on the fourth island. The bombs should be set up there. We are on the fourth island. What do you want? <laughs> Whoa. What? I heard, like, some kind of noise that scared me. That was me, sorry. It's okay. I, like, I thought it was... off my desk. As long as it's not broken. But it was like, mm -mm. you know, like the little uh, pet alert. But it sounded like angry. -ish. So I was like, oh, God, what happened? <laughs> what did I do? It really wanted to poop. <laughs> it's it's all backed hard. up. It's going to explode. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> hey, check it out. Whoa. Whoa. The entrance is destroyed. It's been blown to bits as if someone set off a bomb. I get it. Littering. <laughs> if that's true, looks like this place was spot on. D damn it! The, then the bombs are inside here. Punch damn the McConaughey. Right. Punch the bombs. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> that's what it looks like. Um, then let's try going inside. But we need to be careful. We need to pay as much attention as we can. You're right. He's like, I don't know which one's gonna trigger this, so... Uh... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> did Nagito destroy the door? He sure did a thorough job. Thorough is such a weird Are we screwed? word. It is. Door. But still, he didn't even try to hide the door he destroyed. I mean, he gave a hit. Yeah, like... Duh. Like, there's no hiding it. Like, what do you want? <laughs> okay, we already said this. Jeez. Like I said, if you keep worrying about shit like that, you won't get anything done. Just prepare for the worst. Chris says, knock knock, open up the door, it's a real non-stop pop pop of corn. <laughs> <laughs> what? Are you scared? Do you want me to go in first? No. It's fine. Hmm. I mean, it's not like we know for certain that the bombs are in there. Let's go see what's inside for now. Whoa, stop it. Listen. How can you grip the trouser snake if you do not enter its den? Excuse I don't think me. that's what you wanted to say. Excuse <laughs> me. You can, you can just hear me be like, what? Wait, uh, <laughs> what are you talking about? Well, it is the same for situations like this, right? You know God. there's a danger, but you still must face it. Um, what does grip the trouser snake mean anyway? Uh, that should just be snake. Hey, hey, hey. Hold it. The way she said it is just fine. If you don't correct her, she'll say it as many times as you want. Because we 
which is you... so fucking creepy. <laughs> Good job, Hajime. Miss Sonia's words just now have been etched onto my heart. I see. He's trying to ease everyone's tension. That's pretty considerate of him. Or is it? <laughs> you? What are you doing? The bombs are inside, right? Let's go! <laughs> You gotta <laughs> fucking leave. No. <laughs> I'm scared. I hate this. I how come Come on. I, I mean, how do you play games nope. not knowing? I'm afraid. Go. We have to go. I have to play go forward. Progressing. I don't understand well, this concept. Go. <laughs> I'm a fear. After go. forcing a dry swallow, I nervously stepped through the door. That's because Nagito is not here right now. Stop. <laughs> And what does there... that even mean? What does that even mean? <laughs> the hell is oh. that? What the fuck? I thought we were going to get into the... What is uh, going on? Song. It looks like a cathedral. <laughs> Where's Jack the Builder? Stop. Oh my god! I'm <laughs> just saying it's pretty in here. Yeah. What is this place? I thought the inside would look more lighthearted than this. Why, what else do you want? Um. This ambience is similar, similar to that of a temple or a church. However, is it just me or does it seem like there are no bombs to be found here? Well. No, it's not just you. Hmm. I just had a. I, I just had a thought okay what if the what if the trial is in that vault the last one Ooh, you're right oh. that's what I, I was like wait like right they explore almost everything and the only things they haven't explored is the vault so what if that was the last place they had yeah. also chris has the face when dang and romp has turned into dark souls Chris, tell me what happens. Hurry. <laughs> well, we gotta keep going as we only got 15 minutes. If the bombs are strong enough to blow up the entire island, they should be pretty big. But I don't see anything. I don't see a place where they could be hidden either. <gasps> then the bombs aren't here? The bombs aren't here? The but even so. <laughs> I feel like there's something suspicious here. But why? It feels like this place is different somehow. This feeling, it's the same feeling I felt when I first saw that ancient ruin. Wow, that was an awkward sentence. This feeling, it's the same feeling I felt when I first saw. That lens flare though, holy crap. Chris says, I will not spoil anything suffer as your ancestors did. <laughs> Spear. Spear? Cassandra! <gasps> oh my god. I don't like this. He's floor, gonna fucking to he's gonna fucking kill us. That's what I'm, yeah. I'm I'm no, out of here. Not. I'm out of here, bro. Look at the floor. <laughs> there's still stuff. There's still nothing strange that catches my eye. Okay. He means something oh, strange. Yeah, he must mean there. something. Yeah. That's like right. the opposite. <laughs> this. Look at the floor. Okay. Hmm. Dinosaur. Yeah, perhaps they're buried under the floor. Maybe. No, that's not it. There's no sign that the floors were dug up. Hmm. Then where are the bombs? If the door was really blasted open, then there's no doubt that Nagito was here. D damn it! There's no bombs here? Then where the heck are they? That is... If the bombs are strong enough to blow up the entire island, they should be rather large. However, no matter where we search, we've not found anything like that at all, right? Damn right. Hey, looks like something's written on the floor. Jehovah. <laughs> the floor? Huh? Here, look closely. No. Okay. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> looks like there's something written from the window to the wall. <laughs> That'd be so fun. You can imagine. <laughs> hey, look, what's that? He fucking slaps you. <laughs> <laughs> Since we've never been here before, I thought this place was going to be it for sure. 
Nagito better not be making stuff up just to mess with us. There's a huge Nordic looking spear on the wall. It looks a little flashy, but... I don't like this. I have a strong feeling that this spear isn't just for decoration. Anyway, it's really strange looking. There's some kind of cord attached to the end of the handle. Which means? This weapon is designed to capture an opponent using the cord as a whip just before you deliver the final blow. Please, stop. <laughs> Please. So it's like a chainsicle. However... <laughs> No, no one's acknowledging that. that. No one's <laughs> acknowledging that fucking joke because it wasn't good and nobody needs to hear that again. Using whip as a weapon is quite difficult. You might capture yourself instead of your intended target. That is right. No. And you might also cause an unexpected fan service moment. Why are you <laughs> why are you watching? <laughs> She's thinking of Mikan, Rip Mikan. <laughs> Chris says he's doing the Anchorage DLC in Fallout since it's honestly kinda of boring. What are you talking about? <laughs> Beautiful fighters who get themselves into immodest situations are in universal demand. <sighs> we miss you, Mekon. <laughs> like I said, <laughs> what are you uh, talking about? Hot bitch, Sonya says Sonya is lit, always horny, low key. She doesn't have Gundam anymore, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> That's true. How dare you? She's got the hamster still. Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I like the, uh, the best moment. I think my favorite Sonya moment is when they're like all about to get on the fucking roller coaster, and they're like, and it's just like, no, she's a virgin. She's like, no, I'm not. <laughs> and just everyone's like, what? <laughs> and then they never acknowledged it again. Oh shit! Uh, he did get into the ruins, and he scratched out the password. God damn you, Nagito. Yeah. What's this? This font doesn't match the ambiance of the castle at all. It's almost like it was intentionally put here. Hey everyone, come check this out. What's that? To all subjects. Subjects? Who are they talking about? Is it about us? There's more written below that. What does it mean? The password to guide everyone to the future is. Lies. Garble, garble, garble. What the heck is this? I can't even read the most important part. Like... What does the password to guide everyone to the future even mean? Y you are not this stupid. Huh. Maybe it's that password. Could it be? Could it be the password to access that ancient ruin? Guide everyone to the future. Maybe that refers to the Japanese word that's written on the door? Whoa! Uh, as expected of Miss Sonia, she only had to read it once to understand what it means. I can barely read. <laughs> <coughs> <laughs> but if we can't read the password, there's nothing we can do. It's a rather tragic moment. Hmm. Hey, hey. I wonder who erased this. Erased. So, I mean, it doesn't feel like it was erased naturally, right? It looks like it was forcibly scratched off. That's the only way I can see it. Even so. But Monami and Monokuma shouldn't have entered the castle because they don't like mice, right? I won't forgive you. Then it was Nagito. He's the one who erased the password. Unforgivable. <laughs> <laughs> Perhaps. Nangito probably discovered the password here and used it to enter the ancient ruin. Then he hit the bombs inside the ancient ruin? So Damn. we erased the password so we wouldn't be able to get near the bombs. That actually makes a lot of sense. If that's true. He gave us a hint, even though he knew we wouldn't be able to use it. Don't tell me. Just so we could shove that reality in our faces? There's no way we can enter that ancient ruin if we don't know the password. In the end, we can't do anything about the bombs unless a traitor comes forward. Did he lure us to this place so we'd be forced to confront that? Forcing us to confront the despair before us. 
forcing us to confront how powerless we are. Damn it, that's what Monokuma would do. Hmm. Uh. Hey, uh. Whoever you are, you don't have to reveal yourself to us. Just tell Nagito. If you don't, you'll just end up dying too, you know? You. Hey, who are you saying that to? <laughs> I don't know, I'm just saying it to everyone. Oh, let's stop. Fighting among ourselves won't help anything. More importantly, let's work harder to find the... Uh, to find the password to that ancient ruin, or clues that might be related to it. Hey. See, I think this is smart. I think Nagito kind of ruled out Kazuichi now, because, like... Why would Kazuichi spend all this time trying to root out the traitor if he was the traitor and remembered, and knew that that would just be a waste of time? Well, so, he knows it's not Kazuichi, and he thinks it's not Hajime. Yeah, so. so he's already, like, ruled out half the people just by having us fuck around for an afternoon. He's not watching us, though. So, it's just Monokuma who sees it. Hmm. Maybe. I don't trust him for shit, and <laughs> it's not like there's not cameras in places on the island. But he has like, no we were fucking around with the camera it. before. Like, we were messing around with the camera before. Wow. Well, it's broken now. I'm just saying he had time to plant fucking bombs all over the entire island. He might be up to some shit that people didn't notice. Oh, like make something? Yeah, or just root through the electronics and find another camera that works. Like. Yeah. Well, as long as we cooperate and explore all over the island, we might be able to find it, you know? D damn it! Are you telling us to look everywhere for a password that might not even exist? Hey! Who would leave a password here in the first place and why? If it wasn't Monokuma or Monami, then who was it? We can't even answer that, so there's no way we'll be able to find anything. Please wait! What would you have us do? Just wait until we're all, we all die? That is no different than when we were in the funhouse. And what did we learn there? Learn not to give up on living, right? Hmm. Th that... Gundam was the only one who said that. Oh. Very well, then. I should look out for it on my own. Excuse me. Yeah, fuck you, Kazuichi. Yeah, right? Sonya, hold on. But Sonya ignored me as I called for her and stormed out of the area. Her shoulders were shaking a little. I'm sure of it. I mean... What? What the heck? Shut up! Shut up! Damn it! Fine then! You wanna look for it? Well, fine. Hey! Kazuichi left Nizumi Castle and walked in the opposite direction of Sonya. What the hell are they doing? Now's not the time for infighting. Like... Well, it might be a good idea to work separately. Huh? Why? Huh? I mean, it's easier to move around that way, you know. In case someone wanted to secretly go meet someone. Hey, does that mean... Sorry. <sighs> Just act like I was thinking out loud and pretend you weren't listening. Damn it. Not again. Man, we're scattered as usual. Stupid fool. Seriously. If you think so, then please help. Yeah, leave it to me. I got a secret plan. I won't forgive Does it you. involve punching him? <laughs> yep, there it goes. <laughs> I just have to find the source of the problem and snap it off. Akane, what, so what's your secret plan? I don't think it's that much of a secret. I have a bad feeling about the way Akane's acting. I'll run after her. It's best if we keep Akane away from Nagito for now. Far away. You're right, I guess I'll leave it to you. Yep. Okay, see you later. Chucky ran after Akane. And from there, I was the only one left. Hmm. What does this really mean? Who are the subjects that are being referred to? What's the password to guide everyone to the future? 
Huh. I mean, they got a partial password there. I was the last to leave Nazumi Castle, and I wandered all over the island searching for clues to the password. But I didn't expect to find anything, and in the end, that's exactly what happened. And so, time passed by with its usual speed. Like, basically, couldn't find anything at all? Yep, it's completely useless. Hope Speak Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an announcement to make. It is now 10 p.m. Please return to your rooms and relax. Let the sound of the ocean gently rock you to sleep. Now then, sweet dreams, everyone. Good night. Even after the announcement, I kept searching the island, but I didn't find what we were looking for. After a while, I had forgotten what I was supposed to be looking for in the first place. What? You never done that? Not when my life is on the line. I think he doesn't mean literally, like, I forgot I was looking for a password. He's just like, what's the point? Like, I have no idea where to start to look for clues, is what he's trying to say there. Oh. In the end, after coming up empty-handed, I returned to the hotel. Huh. <sighs> I didn't see anyone else on my way back here, but I also didn't see them while I was exploring, either. That's because, even though this island is so vast, our numbers have drastically decreased since we arrived. I can't think of any other reason than that. Hmm. I should go back. Nagito said time's run out. time runs out at noon tomorrow. Another day is about to end, which means there's only half a day left. I can't imagine the traitor will be revealed by then, since we don't even know if they really exist. And even if they do, it's possible they've forgotten that they're the traitor. All this thinking makes me feel like I should do something about... My brain and body were yearning for rest, probably because of all the walking I did today. As I dozed off, horrible, disgusting images began to surface from the back of my mind, one after the other. Before I could focus on the specifics of those images... I slowly sank into the depths of darkness. Damn, dude. Hey, um... I think giving up is really important. Okay. If you don't give up <laughs> on your dreams, they'll come true. That's just irresponsible and lazy encouragement. No matter how much you try without giving up, it's useless in the end. Persistence is just the worst, so that's why giving up is so important. But you can't give up if you don't even try. That's all from Monokuma Theater! <laughs> That's actually the worst of all. Um. You got it, buddy. <laughs> Ahem! Hope Speak Academy School Trip Exec- Good morning, everyone! Now then, let's show some enthusiasm and make sure to give it our all today! The scenery this morning is the same as it ever was. I can see the sunlight peeking through the window. I can hear the faint sound of waves crashing on the beach. But the bombs Nagito have set are going to destroy all this once time runs out at noon. At the moment, there's nothing about our situation that's changing for the better. Usually I'd go to the restaurant, but what should I do today? As long as I remember what Nagito said... Oh, by the way, I'll be waiting here, so if you want to reveal yourself, come see me anytime. Mr. or Miss Trader. It sounds like he was planning to hang out at the restaurant all day. Wait a minute, he's going to be there all day? Then if anyone went to the restaurant like they normally do, the bad feeling lingering in my chest grew with each beat of my frantic heart. I immediately ran out of my cottage. Wow. Oh, I'm not even going to give you a chance to save the game, huh? Damn. Oh, oh, they are giving you a chance right there. Get the fuck out of your own house. Yeah, well, I guess we're going to see uh, what's going on in the hotel restaurant next time. Wait, turn? Oh, no, no, other side of the door. What? Stop. Oh, yeah, I thought that was Monokuma. You see how that... <laughs> no, no, you see how the... Uh, up, yeah, where the arrow is pointing. You see how? Yeah, no, just no, to the right of that. 
The um, camera. The camera. You see how it's black and white? I thought that was a oh, Monokuma. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. Jack's having visions. Uh, <laughs> no, don't talk to her. We gotta save the game. Good morning, Hachime. Hi. Um, about yesterday, I may have been somewhat careless with my words. I could not keep myself from snapping what Kazuichi said, and I acted on my own. Thanks to my actions, everyone ended up going their own separate ways, right? Yeah, but what you said wasn't wrong either. Um, I have not given up yet. I'll do my very best to live until the very end. If not, I'll not be able to face Gundam, Nekamara, or the others who have died. <laughs> Whatever their names were. <laughs> Jesus. Alright. Well, we're gonna stop things here for now. Right, Sash? Yeah. Yeah. We got some cool shit to look forward to next week, though. You wanna sure. check, check our pet? Nothing. Maybe we'll have some poop by then. <laughs> I hope so. Poop time. Poop. Uh, I don't even know if it's worth, uh... If it's worth, like, you know, doing all the gifts for it, because we he, they might not be alive. The little <laughs> pet thingy. I, I, I mean, I get the vibe that, like, we're two streams away from finishing this, probably. Yeah, really. Here, I'll just really walk our... <laughs> <laughs> I'll just give in some st extra steps there. Tape down your W key. <laughs> well, Jack, you got anything for us before the end of the stream here? I sure don't. Well, you should. You know why? Why? Because you big gay. Big gay. <laughs>